The Stanley Cup getting a parade befitting the Tampa Bay area. This is a live look here from Eagle 8 HD. It's a boat parade through town for the Tampa Tampa Bay Lightning. The Stanley Cup champions. Our live parade coverage begins right now on WFLA Now. Hey there, buddy. JB Buno here with you live with Gabrielle Shirley here on the right side of your screen. You can use the hashtag HeyJB, hashtag HeyGabrielle, and hashtag Go Bolts to have some fun with us here on WFLA. Now, it's all about fun today. <laughs> no more tension. No more worrying about whether or not a game was going to go into overtime or how many goals were going to be scored or whether or not Vasilevsky was going to be great. and All that. It's all in the past. This is now the end of the season and now the celebration, of course, for the Tampa Bay Lightning. Mark Mercado, the very first one <laughs> with the hashtag Go Bolts. Okay, so from Eagle 8 HD here, everybody, you can see there in the center of your screen, the Tampa Bay Lightning, we just saw the players, including Steven Stamkos, carrying the cup onto the boat that is going to be shepherded through town on the Hillsborough wow. River along the city walk here in the city of Tampa. Uh, if you're joining us from here in the city of Tampa, maybe you want to know where is the Stanley Cup? When is it going to come to my spot on the parade route? We're here with you the entirety of the way. We're going to be here with you for the next two hours here as the Stanley Cup is presented to you, the fans. You've been waiting for this. You've been watching all season long, all postseason long, all Stanley Cup final long. They, of course, have won the Stanley Cup, and now the real fun begins for the city of Tampa and the entire Tampa Bay area. Gabrielle Shirley, this is the fun part. This is the fun part. I mean, look at all of those people out there. There are so many boats in the water when Eagle 8 HD zooms out. You can see them all just waiting to follow these players and the Stanley Cup to, I believe they're ending at Ricks on the River. If that's um, accurate, they're going to go through the water here. Look at that shot. Yeah, so let's go. Let's go boats. full screen. Full screen here as Rod Filipenko hashtag go bolts here as well. Look at all the boats Ow. in the water. Do not go anywhere if you're joining us. And if you want to tag a friend <laughs> so here on cool. Facebook Live, maybe retweet this video if you're on Twitter, or maybe talk about it here. We're also streaming to YouTube Live. We are live to a whole lot of different places right now. Uh, but let your friends, let your family know this is the ultimate Tampa Bay celebration here for the Lightning. And as a reminder here, okay, we... Shot a note over to the mayor's office on WFLA now earlier on in the Stanley Cup final after I think it was game three. And we said, hey, what are the we of course, with the COVID-19 pandemic, there were a lot of concerns out there regarding a parade in the streets of Tampa. Right. Now we and you know, we had a lot of people chiming in, Gabby, saying, what about a boat parade? Let's do a boat parade. How perfect would it be for Tampa to do a boat and parade? And here we are now just several days later, a week or so later after that all went down. And we do, in fact, have a boat parade to share with you here on WFLA Now for the Stanley Cup champion, Tampa Bay Lightning. Adam Campbell joining us here with the hashtag Go Bolts. What do you think of this day? Use the hashtag HeyJB, hashtag hey Gabrielle. We want to hear from you folks joining us here at home. We'll continue to throw your comments using one of those hashtags on screen. Dorothy Kuttner, hashtag Go Bolts here as well. Again, endless amounts of confetti here on WFLA now. Taryn asked the KGB, are they going to Ray J too? You better believe it, Taryn. They are going to Ray J. And uh, you know who's also going to Ray J? Yeah, Gabrielle Shirley I'll might make a cameo appearance. What do we <laughs> expect tonight at Raymond James Stadium at the conclusion of the boat parade tonight, Gabby? Oh my gosh, JB, that's a great question. I mean, yes, it's some sort of celebration, and it's this part is for the Lightning as well as for the fans. Last night, the Lightning were at Amelie Arena, and that was for a select group of family, friends, etc. But tonight, this is all about the city of Tampa and, and we, those fans. And we have Jeff Patterson delivering a live report Ooh, on WFLA. Let's, let's listen in. Reporting live from Davis Island, Jeff Patterson, eight on your side. And that's how it goes, of course. Sometimes we <laughs> toss to our reporters in the field doing live shots for television, and they're wrapping up their live reports. So that's why we're always trying to chime in or bring you in here with our various reporters in the field. I think that we're going to hear from eight on your sides. Victoria Price next is, again, we are live here from the one, the only, Paul Lamison in Eagle 8 HD here, everybody. Yeah, uh, Paul is our photojournalist, our chief photojournalist here at WFLA, <laughs> providing us with the aerial coverage here. And I think that uh, he is standing by. We're going to be hearing from him throughout the broadcast here today as Melissa Gindling, hashtag Go Bolts. And also Victoria Price oh, yeah, is uh, moments okay. away from giving us a live report here on WFLA <laughs> now. Hashtag Go Bolts. Also from Sylvia Ann watching here from Swanee, Georgia. Very, very cool here, everybody. Let's get you back out here full screen. The boat 
carrying the Stanley Cup has not yet departed here, but it's going to be making its way down the Hillsborough River here shortly, folks. And uh, if you're on the City Walk, if you're uh, lined up there on the Hillsborough River waiting, well, we're moments away from seeing the Stanley Cup set sail. Charlene Turnbull, awesome. Hashtag go bolts here as well. Let's listen Bring to Victoria Price. Ready to, to see the cup make its way down the river. A lot of people saying the boat parade is the perfect way to celebrate the Stanley Cup here in Tampa because we're Floridians. We love to be on the water and that is what we do. So clearly very excited here and people are pulling out all of the stops. The kayak shop that's down here at Armature Works, they're actually going to be doing a celebratory paddle. So they're getting ready. They're going to be pulling the kayaks and the paddle boards out to greet the bolts when they come down the Hillsboro River. There's also people who I've talked to who have driven 15 hours. You heard me right, 15 hours to be here today. Take a listen. And Victoria tossing to, of course, some of the interviews that we did earlier on today on WFLA Now. Hey, you might have heard of a guy named Alex Kalorn. Well, check out what he was wearing here, Gabby, on so, the like way So, like I said, pulling out all the stops here at Armature Works. I mean, it's, you know, we won the cup and the fans weren't there, but now we get to really enjoy it with them. And that's really what it's about because they're a huge reason why, you know, why we do so well. You're amazing. Thank, Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Not not just the Tampa Bay Rays jersey there, but also the belt, the belt. rocking the championship belt. This is live here in the center of your screen from Eagle 8 HD. That was Alex Kalorn. This is a live feed here showing where the Stanley Cup is going to be momentarily making its way down the Hillsborough River. Jeff Knowles, hashtag AJB, will killer be on his jet ski? <laughs> Gabrielle, what, what, do you, what do you think? What do we say here for Jeff? <laughs> Jeff, he was definitely tweeting. I forget the exact words that he used, but I think he said something to the effect of, hey, Tampa, the jet ski is ready. I don't think there's a going to be a jet ski appearance today. I could be wrong. I feel that he'll be with his team on the boat with the Stanley Cup. But, yes, you can bet that at some point the Stanley Cup killer and a jet ski will all collide into some epic photo, ride, shoot, et cetera, because that is what Alex Kalorn does. He is a quote-unquote social media influencer. We cannot forget that. Taryn here, hashtag go bold. Paul gets the best view ever. Man, does he ever? Yeah, this he is does. one of those days where if you are this man here, the one, the only, uh, Paul Amison, you have a really cool job. We're going to be hearing from Paul, as I understand it, a little bit later on in the live stream here on WFLA Now. Uh, he is currently, of course, uh, talking to on air here on WFLA News Channel 8, your NBC station right here in Tampa Bay. Uh, but yeah, he's providing with some unbelievable aerial shots here. Uh, really, really awesome. JB, can you spot the cup on that big boat at the top of the screen? Let's there? go full screen here. There and it there is. it is. I Victor think that that, Hedman, that appears to be, that is one large human being. <laughs> and I would imagine that that right there is Victor Hedman effortlessly hoisting the, uh, the Stanley Cup above his head. Best feeling in the world if you're, if you're a hockey player. Best feeling in the world. Best feeling in the player. world if, if you uh, have a pulse. I mean, right? I mean, hoisting the Stanley Cup, it is a very, very special thing. It is the coolest trophy in the world, bar none. Uh, the Lombardi Trophy in football, yeah, that's cool. I guess the, of course, the NBA final, Finals Trophy is pretty neat too, but nothing like the Stanley Cup. Phyllis Harmon, hashtag Go Bolts. Hey, again, if you want to interact with us here in the WFLA Now Stream Center, you can use hashtag go bolts, hashtag hey JB, hashtag hey Gabrielle. Rebecca Fugit, hashtag go bolts. So happy and proud of you. Enjoy the celebration. Mm. Okay, we have another shot here to show you. Uh, I, I, it's from the ground, and it's of the one and the only. Oh, check this out here. You're going to love this, folks. Steven Stamkos uh, posing for pictures. There is the cup. <laughs> <laughs> and there, I believe that's the cons, uh, the cons my trophy. trophy yes, it correct? is. Yep. yep, awarded to Victor Hedman. Let's see if we can listen in here, everybody. We're going to listen in, and we might uh, hear some of the exchanges. Victor, 
May I ask you? I've got a socially distant microphone. Is that okay? Thank you. It would seem Victor Hedman's coming over for an interview. Let's listen. I haven't seen you since you guys got back. And Thank you. Just, just amazing. Yeah. Uh, put it into words for me. What does this mean to you personally? Uh, that's a tough question to put into words. I don't know if I can. Not yet, anyways. It's uh, still this, you know, I'm going to need a lot of time to just exhale and think back, but I'm so happy. It's, it's. I mean, from youth yeah. hockey to junior hockey, yeah. all the way up through, I mean, and now you've got the con Smythe. Yeah. I mean, I know you said it's a team trophy. Yeah. But, Victor, um, <laughs> you have the con Smythe trophy. Yeah. It's yeah, I know. It's, you look back and, you know, I'm from a town with 30,000 people in the northern part of Sweden, and uh, now I'm here with the Stanley Cup, and like I said, the con Smythe, it's, uh, yeah, it's unreal. You know, I'm, I'm so, so happy, and so proud of you know the way we came together as a group and so in all our families you know the sacrifice they made to 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 let us go chase our dream uh that means so much for us to be here with them now means the world uh you know obviously missing a big part of our families back in sweden but you know being here with my, with my wife it just means so much and, and uh we're gonna have we're gonna have a blast i know you've made tampa your home um this is a uniquely Tampa celebration you're about to take part of. What I do you know. think of this? It's awesome, you know. Let's hope we don't run into any other boats, but I'm pretty sure these guys know how to handle their boats. So, you know, this is uh, probably the first time you're going to see a parade in water. So, But it's no better place to do it than here. You know, like you said, this is our home. We love it here. We've been here for over a decade. So uh, just looking forward to sharing this moment with, uh, with our fans. I know you can't tell it because I'm wearing a mask, but I'm smiling really big for you right now because I'm, I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah, thank thank you. you for everything you've done for this community. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. I'll keep doing it. All right, buddy. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson interviewing there. Victor Hedman, the Conn Smythe Trophy um, winner there. Uh, can we... Can we can we point something out here if we can? Can somebody get uh, get Victor Hedman over to Gasparilla? He said he's never been to a boat parade. Did you did you catch that? That this is his first boat parade? I'm hoping that he just was talking about a boat parade for the Stanley Cup final. But. Right. I think that's maybe what he meant. <laughs> but if this is his first ever boat parade or maybe his first time partaking in a boat parade, as in being part of it and not, you know, on the side, uh, on land watching it, how cool is this going to be for somebody like Victor Hedman? Conn Smythe Trophy winner, a, a foundational piece of this franchise for the Tampa Bay Lightning, and now he gets to hoist the Stanley Cup on the water here for thousands and thousands of screaming Tampa Bay Lightning fans. I mean, it doesn't get much cooler than that. Live here from Eagle 8 oh, HD no, in the center good. of your screen. Again, use hashtag KJB, hashtag Hey Gabrielle, hashtag Go Bolts. Uh, let's take you out here again live, show you that picture there from the ground from Jeff Patterson's camera. Oh, are we getting onto the boat? This is a cool yacht. I mean, we were wondering now, Gabby, which boat was going to be carrying the Stanley Cup. And we wondered if it was going to be the Jose Gaspar. Now, we, we did some more <laughs> conversing about that. It is an enormous effort to mobilize the Jose Gaspar. It does not move on its own. It is, in essence, uh, a barge that, that has to be, of course, pushed, in essence, or pulled down the, uh, down the river. So it will not be the Jose Gaspar, the famous Gasparilla ship here uh, in Tampa Bay. It will instead be that beautiful yacht that you saw there, befitting, of course, uh, for the Stanley Cup. Uh, again, here from Eagle 8 HD, we have a lot of different cameras moving around here, folks, in different sections of Tampa to take you to different parts of the Hillsborough River. So we are really, uh, of course, going to gonna bring you the best shots here uh, from the Hillsborough River. Robert Gardner, hashtag Go Bolts. I will be at the stadium tonight with my family. Can't wait. And let's talk about the stadium here really quickly. Gabby was talking about it a, a little bit earlier on. The ticket's were available on Ticketmaster. They were for free at 1 o'clock on Tuesday. They quickly ran out of those tickets, so you can only get to that event if you have uh, one of those tickets from Ticketmaster or if you're like Gabrielle Shirley here with a press pass. Very, very... Uh, that's the, one of the perks of the job, I guess, <laughs> is that you get to flash your press pass and get into the stadium here. 
uh, as uh, we have a comment here from Michael Johnson. Michael Johnson, hashtag hey JB, too bad I don't think the gas bar will be able to make an appearance. Fire the cannons, hashtag go bolts. Yes, fire the cannons. I assume that that will be happening at Raymond James Stadium tonight. We shall see. I will be there taking in all of the sights and sounds for you guys. Um, anyone that was able to get a ticket, those tickets were free. They went up online. They are sold out, sold out, even though they were free. Uh, but, yeah, pretty exciting. Tampa Bay Lightning players and the Stanley Cup, of course, will be there. Oh, here, Joy Matthews. She is back. Hashtag HeyJB. Two things make the cup cooler than the other trophies you mentioned. How each player gets it for a day to take it back to their hometown, etc., and that their names are all on it. Hashtag Go Bolts. That Stanley Cup trophy, man. I think it was moved to the front um, of that larger boat there on the right side of your screen. I think I see it up there in the corner. Uh, Victor Hedman on that boat, Steven Stamkos, a couple of the Lightning players with their significant others, perhaps even some parents, family, friends, etc. whoever can fit on there. Really exciting. Victor Hedman in that interview, he was talking about really the people, how this entire team came together to win the cup and how grateful he was to be back here in Tampa with the fans and, of course, his wife. So really special for this team, really special for this city. Let's go to this comment here. Carol Ragsdale, hashtag go bolts. Hedman's wife is due to have a baby any day now. Wow. That's really exciting. What timing all around for that family. Well, let's talk about that now. Uh, as as Steven Stamkos hoist, hoist the <laughs> cup there. Really cool. Pass, getting it passed to him from Victor Hedman there. Uh, awesome shot here from Eagle awesome 8 HD. Shot. Let's talk about that for a second. So if... Victor Hedman's uh, lovely partner gives uh, gives birth at ahead of his day with the cup. Then you get to put the newborn in the cup, right? You get to take that picture. <laughs> a baby in the cup. Another baby in the cup. Blake Coleman did it yesterday. It never gets old. <laughs> never, never gets old here, buddy. Uh, there's, you want to know where we are? Okay, you see that tower there in the center of your screen with the big eight on it? We're beneath that, in that building there. And there you see all the boats ready for uh, really the ultimate escort down the Hillsborough River. Uh, really cool here to see this um, and, and see all the boats here from Eagle 8 HD. Here's one from Matthew the Bucksman. Matthew the Bucksman, hashtag hey JB, this is awesome. Plus the Rays are winning seven to one. Go yeah. Bolts, Rays up. Yes, actually, Matthew the Bucksman, I was just pulling up that score. You are right, 7-1, to one, I believe, bottom of the third. That's awesome. The Rays, they needed to win two out of three games in this best of three series, and they won last night with Blake Snell on the mound. So the Rays are well on their way in this postseason already. Okay, here's another comment from Mopar Joe. Hashtag, hey, JB, I hope the Lightning have cup replica rings made for fans to buy. Wow, that is another element that perhaps is possible. I've never heard of that. Um, JB, do you know anything about that? Cup, no, no, I don't. Replica rings? Um, but that would be, uh, there's going to be replica everything. Um, <laughs> there's going to be replica rings, replica Stanley Cups. Uh, just, my goodness, I, I would imagine eBay listings are popping up as we speak. Going crazy. Yeah, here's a comment from Sean Fagan. Hashtag Go Bolts. We'll have celebrated Monday at stadium, celebrated at the stadium when they came on trolleys, and we'll be there tonight. So excited to go there. Sean, you've been following this team very closely. And yes, celebration after celebration after celebration. Man, tonight's going to be fun. I don't want it to end. I really don't. Now, I, I've been told is we're going to get to, to Greg Robinson's comment here. Really, really cool. Not only do we have everybody Eagle 8 HD in the air right now with Paul Lamison aboard and giving us these aerial shots here in the center of your screen, which we're going to be, of course, displaying full screen here with you. We also have a camera on the media boat. Yeah, that's right. We're going to have a camera on the boat itself that's going to be following the Stanley Cup. So if you want really just eye candy, I mean, <laughs> the Stanley Cup is Stay with us. the preeminent eye candy of all trophies, right? So we are going to be bringing you Stanley Cup worthy coverage here on WFLA Now on the water. In the air, cameras on the ground, land, sea, and air. We have you covered here to see all different angles of how the city of Tampa and how the Tampa Bay area is celebrating this incredible Stanley Cup run for the Tampa Bay Lightning. Uh, Linda Jervis, hashtag go bolts as we get you back out here. Full screen, everybody. Look at all the boats, Gabby. <laughs> 
<laughs> JB, I, I, I knew there was going to be an excellent turnout. I didn't know exactly what to expect. This is already more than I could have expected. Here's a comment from Greg Robinson. Thank you, WFLA Now, for streaming this so that those of us that live out of the area can see the celebrations. I'm a fan since the beginning and in Dallas for now. Hashtag go Bolts. Greg, thank you for tuning in. Yes, it is so, so exciting, and we are very happy to be able to bring this to everyone who wants to see it. Another comment from Cameron Ocampo, hashtag go Bolts, ran down my street screaming with my Tampa Bay lightning flag. I don't think my neighbors were too happy about that. Smiley, laughing face. Cameron, that's awesome. I would have done the same exact thing. Oh, now who is on that jet ski? I don't think that's anyone of a player. Definitely not Kalorn. He was wearing a Rays jersey. All right, here's a comment from Josh Bernard. Hashtag go Bolts. They better fire them cannons for the lightning tonight at Ray J. That would be cool. I would I expect nothing would. less. I right. bet they would. I would exactly. I, I would expect <laughs> nothing less. And uh, and for and yeah, and I think that Tom Brady had been giving uh, giving some love to the Tampa Bay Lightning as well. Uh, oh, for sure. It, it, it's very much. Um, uh, a city all about unity between its sports franchises, between the Rays, the Bucks, and the Lightning. Jonathan Skorotsky is back. Hashtag go Bolts. Hashtag AJB Bolts <laughs> riding dirty with Stanley on that boat. Oh, yeah. Really, uh, it's going to be really cool to see the Stanley Cup aboard that, uh, that boat that's going to be making its way down the Hillsborough River. I have now been informed by our digital content producer, Rob, that the man that you saw there on the jet ski was none other than Alex Kalorn. It was! Alex Kalorn a switch? on a jet ski. Now, if we, have, if we have another shot of that, we'll bring it to you here. And uh, i got to get a hold of Paul Lamison in here. Uh, Gabby, why don't, you, why don't you continue to read some comments here? Again, you can use the hashtag AJB, hey hashtag hey Gabrielle hashtag go bolts, like here from Adam Vosding. Oh, look. And, uh, oh, okay, so there, uh, okay. there it is. Okay, is that Kalorn? Now, Kalorn was wearing a Tampa Bay Rays jersey Which earlier with the championship belt. Very easily switched. Yeah, it's one of the players, well, and why not? It would definitely be Kalorn. Cl clearly a life vest on here. Good, smart, safety first. But is that a, yeah, it, it's, hard to, it's hard to say, but I, I, I believe, I believe in our digital content producer, Rob, uh, Rob at WFLA. And, and I'll double check Kalorn's social media status to see if he's confirmed it either way. Let's see. There is the Stanley Cup there, everybody, with Steven Stamkos, with Victor Hedman, a few other players here on that on that black boat there in the center of your screen. Juan Melendez, way to go, Bolts. Hashtag go, Bolts. Hashtag, hey, hey, Tampa Bay. You know, we had, I forgive me, I forget who it was, but someone asked if Kalorn would have the Stanley Cup on a jet ski, and I... Assumed it would happen at some point, not today, but he wastes no time. He wastes no time. If, in fact, it does get on that jet ski, that would be something else. You can see it there, though, on that big, big boat that's with Stammer. Victor Hedman's on there. A couple of the players. And okay, so others. Michael Johnson here talking about uh, half to get when the All-Star game was in town last. Victor Hedman and Eric Carlson dressed up as pirates. I think that they might have been in the Gasparilla Parade. So were they part of the Gasparilla Parade festivities or were they actually on a boat? Because I, I thought that Hedman said this is this is my first boat parade. Or maybe, or Gabby, maybe he did in fact mean that it was his first boat parade. Uh, to, For, yes. With a, with a Stanley Cup with or Stanley Cup. celebrating. Celebratory this, parade, etc. Right, yeah. Right. Oh, Kelly Jacobs. Hashtag AJB. Hey love Victor. Victor Hedman. Yes. He spoke to our Jeff Patterson. If you guys were watching, you saw that interview and... Uh, like I already mentioned, it was just so nice to hear him. All he was really talking about um, were the people, the people, the team coming together as a group and then being able to celebrate with the fans here in Tampa as well as the players, significant others. Victor Hedman mentioned his wife, which was pretty sweet. She's on the boat with him as well. Let's show you a ground shot here, everybody. Uh, this is, again, from along the Hillsborough River. Some of the fans, oh, okay, we just lost it. But there are a lot of fans in different areas of Tampa along the Hillsborough River that are waiting for this to begin. Uh, give us a shout out. If you're uh, joining us here from along the parade route, the water route, the water 
parade route here <laughs> through uh, the city of Tampa. <laughs> Use hashtag KJB, hashtag hey Gabrielle, hashtag go bolts. I want to hear from you and let us uh, let us know how excited you are to see the Stanley Cup uh, cruise on by on the Hillsborough River past you so that you can see it with your own eyes and cheer on the Tampa Bay Lightning as they hoist the Stanley Cup for you. Shea Byers, congratulations, hashtag go bolts with all the lightning bolt emojis there as well. This one's from Mike Jefferson. I haven't taken my jersey off for two days. Woohoo! Hashtag go bolts, hashtag distant thunder, missing the 813 big time today. Mike Jefferson, tell us where you are right now. Glad you're tuning in. Lightning fan from a distance, distant thunder, as you said. Yes, you're just like JB. JB's been wearing the jersey too. He said he's never he said he's never how, watched. How it. could I take this off? <laughs> <laughs> right here. I haven't gone anywhere. Some Told Eddie and guys. Sam's pizza crumbs Come a few on. nights ago. You just kind of just rub it off the jersey, right? Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, we, we had a pizza night. Uh, there, pizza has yes. been one of superstitions, right? Nights. The nights that we had pizza, they won. They won. Just Pizza's saying. good all just, around. Just saying. Eddie and Sam's, big shout out to you here <laughs> on WFLA now. Uh, and uh, okay, so here from Eagle 8 HD, here's our ground Look shot. And let's go to our ground shot here, too. Uh, some of the boats that look at some of the fans. Oh, it's awesome. That is so great out on the water. And, uh, and some of these shots are going to be moving all over the place. So we'll, we'll be bouncing back and forth here. Uh, let's, uh, Liddy McHenry has to get We were just on your station from armature works. Yeah. That's where Victoria price Liddy, is. Yeah. Liddy. Thanks for joining us here. Ah, uh, Liddy, you're one of our favorites. Thank you for tuning in again, guys. Look at all of these boats out on the water ready to ride along with the Stanley Cup and those Tampa Bay Lightning players. Here's a comment from Corey Milliken. Hashtag KJB just bought my second Hedman jersey. This one has the Stanley Cup champs patch on it. Hashtag go bolts. Wow, what a great jersey. I need one. I need one. All right, everybody. I think it's time to introduce the final member of our team here, the final member of our of our broadcast. We have... We have put this on, put this off, really, for, for far too long. Oh, actually, no, wait. I've been told, I believe that Paul Amison is about to do a hit on News Ooh. Channel 8. Okay, so we're, Paul is in high demand. Paul Lamison, our WFLA uh, chief photographer here, who is providing the aerials. He is in Eagle 8 HD, and if you're ever wondering what that's like, he is in the chopper, of course, our or uh, the chopper that is providing this aerial coverage here for you on WFLA now. He's in the chopper with a joystick, and he a lot of different buttons that control the camera from a, from a, a movement standpoint, from an exposure standpoint. Uh, lighting conditions can be tricky in Tampa Bay because you have weather that can change really in, in instant, a moment, yeah. right, any moment. So you're always controlling the camera in so many different ways, and he is the master at it. That's why we're able to get these stunning aerial views here. We're going to be hearing from Paul here in just a few minutes. Brian Summers, hashtag go bolts. I'm from Oklahoma City for school, but I would give anything to be there for my boys. Go bolts. Very cool. Confetti coming down. Man, I want them to get started on their route. The anticipation, guys, the anticipation. Here's a comment from Laura Gamba Burner, hashtag KJB. I am so unbelievably ecstatic that the Bolts won, well-deserved and needed with this crazy year. She added a little heart on there. Yes, Laura, we agree with you. What a year. I don't know if you have been following some national media comments, wondering if this year deserved an asterisk next to it just because it was such a bizarre year. Everyone has concluded, no, definitely not. And the players have said they think this is the hardest year. This was the hardest year to win a Stanley Cup just because of everything going on. The Dust pause, the bubble, etc. Dustin Ward, hashtag go bolt. So much merch to buy. Don't know where to start first. Yeah, hashtag go bolt. Uh, so much merchandise to get your hands on here, folks. Uh, it, it's, it's not every day your team wins the Stanley Cup. You want to celebrate in style. Wear that blue, wear that Go Bolt Stanley Cup t-shirt. There's Jeff Patterson, who interviewed Victor Hedman a short time ago. He's uh, also standing by for a series of live reports here on WFLA News Channel 8. Corey M Milliken again, hashtag AJB. I'm, I'm Distant Thunder in New York State, and my mom keeps sending me all awesome Bolts gear. Hey, Mom, 
Hashtag go bolts. <laughs> Hashtag best mom. I love that. Corey Milliken joining us from New York, everybody. And, and you know, it's really cool. So New York is just one of those states in the Northeast that because we have such a deep connection with some northern states such as New York, people who have homes, many of them have homes in the Tampa Bay area here. So people who um, might be in, let's say, upstate New York, uh, maybe not close enough to western New York for the bill or excuse me, the Sabres or you know, downstate New York for the uh, for the Rangers or the Islanders, many of them Tampa Bay Lightning fans, or maybe in other states in the Northeast as well, just because they have a home here. And uh, it's it's very cool that we have Lightning fans all across the United States, just because so many people come to our beautiful state, our beautiful region of Florida. Uh, from elsewhere uh, in the country. Ashley Ross, Ashley KJB, anyone seen Thunderbug yet? Hashtag Goebbels. I did see Thunderbug earlier. You did? And maybe we can, uh, you know, it would be yeah, very, very funny. I haven't spotted him yet. If we get Paul here on the call here in just a moment, perhaps we can challenge him. How quickly will it take him to find Thunderbug? Where's Waldo? Can he do it in 60 seconds or less? I bet you he could. <laughs> I bet you he could do it in 30 seconds or less. Uh, Dilaram, oh my goodness, Dizureva, hashtag Go Bolt. Well deserved, so proud to be Tampa Bay, I'm from Russia, so hockey's definitely big for my family. Wow. Uh, you, we, we have, of course, some players that are from Russia, uh, Kucherov being one of them uh, on the Tampa Bay Lightning. So uh, Russia, one of those one of those countries that where lightning, uh, excuse me, the uh, just the sport of hockey is just on such a grand stage. Uh, Tucker Hassel watched the entire playoff from Norfolk, where I'm stationed, always a Tampa native. Hashtag go bolts as we take you here again. Full screen, the Eagle 8 HD, the boat parade. Moments away from starting here. Uh, all the boats have gathered. The time now, 5.30. It just turned over to 5.30 Eastern time. So the boat is about to leave here in moments. Make its way down the Hillsborough River for all of the fans that are waiting. Oh, so patiently. They've been waiting for 16 years. What's another 16 or so minutes, right? <laughs> uh, waiting for the Stanley Cup to make its way down the Hillsborough River in their direction. Here's a comment from Brianna Brockington. Hashtag Go Bolts, watching from D.C., missing Tampa right now. Have fun, guys. Lots of fun to be had here, especially tonight with this boat parade. Then the event at Raymond James Stadium. Look at all of those boats, guys. And, of course, that big boat there on the right of that dock, that is where the Stanley Cup is, I believe, at this moment. Steven Stamkos, Victor Hedman, other players, et cetera, are on that boat. Here's a comment from Chuck Andrews. Hashtag KJB, hey you guys rock. Thank you for the great coverage. I left Tampa at 9.30 Monday night. Crying face. 9.30 Monday night? Where were you going? Happy tears, right? Happy tears? Happy tears? Oh, yeah, maybe happy tears. Happy tears. Let, let's, be, let's be like a glass half full. Like happy tears. Like, oh, my God, I'm so overwhelmed that they won. Right? <laughs> right? Christopher Sanchez, I love watching it with my wife. Hashtag go bolts. Love it. Again, you can use hashtag hey JB or hashtag hey Gabrielle to get our attention. Off. Or who that is. hashtag is that hey, cool? or excuse me, hashtag go bolts. A lot of hashtags here, folks. Lots of hashtags. This one is from Cynthia Kramer Miller. Hashtag Go Bolts. Getting ready to work, but have this streaming. Go Bolts. Lots of exclamation Cynthia, points. Cynthia, thanks for joining us. And love the profile picture. Go Bolts. And, and the, that's one of the cool parts here, too, is that we can see these profile pictures. And a lot of them have uh, have Tampa Bay Lightning logos or Go Bolts uh, uh, symbols on them. Uh, JJ Galsowitz. Hashtag AJB. We have five in our family near Armature Works, including... A one-year-old at her first parade. Hope for a few more. JJ, thanks for joining us, man. And hopefully uh, we're getting a little bit closer to uh, to your way there at Armature Works. Uh, awesome. And thank you for joining us. And, and, and again, let your friends and family members or people in your vicinity know that if they want to track the Stanley Cup down the Hillsborough River, uh, yeah, join us here on WFLA Now. Uh, really, really great to have you. This one is from Jonathan. Oh, JB, this was your last Skorodsky. name. Skorodsky. Hashtag hey, JB. Hashtag hey, Gabrielle. How sweet is this? <laughs> How hashtag sweet is this? Go Bolts. Jonathan, that was excellent. I enjoy that. Yeah, yeah. I have, I have the bad beat button here, too. Perfect. Any Any funny jokes or any dad-related, like, dad jokes? You know, like, oh, if your dad's, like, a lightning fan, he makes that quintessential dad joke i've got the bad beat button ready here folks cameron boy or hashtag kjb what amazing weather today for this two eight one three we're lit baby hashtag go bolts can we talk about the weather for a second 
if only meteorologist Amanda Holly was here and, and able to join us. It is beautiful in Tampa it Bay. It really is. It's a great day. And when I say it's beautiful, I mean that it feels beautiful. We've had some really hot days over the last week or so. I mean, really, really hot. We're talking uh, 90s and, and into the mid-90s at some points and feels even hotter than that just because we've had so much sun, not as much rain as we would normally get. Haven't had that much precipitation. What we have had come in in the, in the last 24 hours is a cold front and it's cooler. So this is a beautiful it day out here today. It is cool, JB. When I was scrolling through my Twitter feeds, <laughs> Instagram, I felt like everyone that lived here in the Tampa area was posting about how it was finally fall, at least for a few hours this morning. It's still really nice outside. It definitely warmed up, but it is a beautiful day. I think it is time here, everybody, to introduce the final member of our team, and it's the one and only Paul Lamison joining us from Eagle 8 HD, the best view in the house. Hey there, Paul. You got a lot of folks watching here on WFLA now. Hey, JB, I've been waiting to talk to you all afternoon, but they have me doing other work. They have me working for a living. Come on. <laughs> Here we are. We're over the lightning boat parade. It hasn't officially started yet. I'm zooming in and showing you. There it is. There's Lord Stanley's Cup on the front, on the bow of that boat. That's uh, Victor Hedman and Steven Stamkos on board that baby. Uh, over here, some more players. Everybody getting ready. Uh, Victor Hedman's on that one. Uh, Alex Kalorn over here. We're hoping he might ride his jet ski, but he's on the front of that boat. He's wearing his Tampa Bay Rays shirt right there. There's his back, number 17, Alex Kalorn on the boat. They haven't started yet. There's a media boat. I'm going to zoom out wide and show you where we are. This is Marjorie Park. This is right on Davis Island, down by the baseball fields. That's the parade starting point. That's where we're still waiting to go. Out here in the water, just people on boats, people hanging out. There's Tampa Fire Rescue on that boat. I saw TPD out here as well. Uh, there's just boats out here celebrating this lightning victory. Now I'm going to move the camera and show you where they're going to go. They're going to leave from here, Marjorie Park, head down Seddon Channel. That's the one that goes right between Harbor Island and Davis Islands, just like the Gasparilla Boat Parade. Except for Gasparilla, they dock right here at the Tampa Convention Center. And look, look at all the people there. This is crazy. This is how you do a parade, you other places. That's why we should win the Stanley Cup every year. Well, then they're going to keep the boat going all the way up the river right here. This is the most important stop. There's News Channel 8. They're going to go right by News Channel 8 on the river, and look at the people on the river walk just packing it in. This is crazy. This is a great way to do a parade on the river and show off what we have to offer. They're going to continue up the river all the way up past uh, Armature Works, which is way up here. There's Armature Works. And it's crowded, too. Look at all the people packed in on Armature Works. There's Armature Works. They're going to make the bend right by Blake High School and then end up way up here. There's Ricks on the River. That's where they're going to end up and see their trolleys. They're going to take those open-air trolleys all the way. I'm going to do this for you. Over to here to Raymond James Stadium. And that's where the big party is going to end up tonight. Go Bucks, go Rays, go Bolts. It's a Tampa Bay town. Now I'm going to come all the way back over here. Downtown Tampa's right here. We're going to get back onto the river. There's Channel 8. Here's the river again, Seddon Channel. And there we go. There's the parade. Look. And they're still docked on the side of the dock waiting to leave. But I think they're going to leave anytime soon. They're packing on. They're getting the Stanley Cup. They're loading up with their we'll say supplies, and there's <laughs> Victor Hedman with the cup right there, people taking selfies. There's Steven Stamkos giving the hay to people out in the crowd, and this is going to be a good time once it gets underway, and it should be any time. And again, there's Victor Hedman getting his, quote, hand supp or his supplies, I'm doing the hand quotes, supplies for the trip. Pick up the trophy and show it to us, Victor. Look at that. This is this is a big deal for these guys, and it's a fun time. And we're up here in Eagle 8 HD, and here's where we are. This is we're just waiting, JB. So this is fun. 
and I, I, I didn't predict the final score correctly. I thought they'd win 4-2. to two. It was 2 nothing, way better than I thought, and that was a fantastic game. So the Lightning doing their job. Bassey with a shutout, so it was good. So I'll throw it back to you, JB. Paul, we got some comments here coming in with the hashtag, hey, Paul. Again, if you want to react here with us on WFLA Now and interact with us and our chief photographer here, Paul Lamison, such as Carol McKinney, you can use the hashtag, hey, Paul. And Carol says, you have the best view, Paul. Thanks <laughs> for the coverage. And, and, Paul, we also have a challenge here for you. We had a comment a little bit earlier on, and I'm going to start the clock okay, here. Okay, the boats are still on the dock. It hasn't officially started. Right. We had one commenter, Paul, see, wanted to know how quickly you could find Thunderbug. We're going to start the clock, and it begins now. <laughs> oh, we lost Paul. Paul's back on TV, I think. No. Okay. Okay, I think we're going we're gonna to challenge him later. It's all about can you find Thunderbug? <laughs> a little bit of a fun game here for our chief photographer, Paul Lamison, as we wait as we wait for this parade to get here underway. Jonathan Skorodsky, hashtag KJB. Any signs of Cooper? Cooper we saw a little bit earlier on. He gave an interview to Channel 8, uh, to WFLE News Channel 8, and uh, we have not seen him here from the sky since, but we'll be keeping an eye out for the head coach of the Tampa Bay Lightning. All right, here's a comment from Christopher Cole. Hashtag, hey, JB, this team is going to be so tired and they're going to need a break after all of this. Absolutely. I would assume that they are running on adrenaline right now because, yes, so many hockey games, back-to-backs. Um, they flew in yesterday, arrived around 5. There was lots of celebrations there, reuniting with families. Then they went to the arena, and now, everyone, they are back. You can bet that they were with their teammates and family friends late into the night last night, then early this morning. And, yes, this is nonstop for them. They are going to need to rest and recover for a while after this. But right now, they're going on adrenaline. They're too happy to stop. And there on the right side of your screen, Victor Hedman alongside Steven Stamkos there with the Stanley Cup. We're going to be taking you to the, our ground and – of water shots here again we're going to have a camera on a boat that is traveling alongside the boat carrying the stanley cup john kruger looks like a beautiful night for a parade hashtag go bolts <laughs> two stanley cups there on our banner because we of course won the stanley cup in 2004 another one here in 2020 all right gabby count them can you count how many boats there are that's not funny. I thought you were going to ask me to count the Stanley Cups, and I said, yeah, I could do that. Yo, two, two Stanley Cups. Now now can we count these boats? Uh, no. I, I, uh, I mean, I, no. We're we need, just going to go with dozens? We need interns again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. we, we, uh, back uh, pre-pandemic, we, we had wonderful interns here at WFLA. And, us, and we could assign an intern uh, that the, the, the duty of, of helping us count these boats. Uh, or if somebody out there would like to give it a shot or guess how many boats there are, but it's pretty much impossible. And the reason why is because the More boats continue. Yes, they continue to arrive here. So you could do a count and then you'd be wrong moments later. Oh, here's a water gun shooting out <laughs> some water. Is it getting that boat super wet right there? That white one? <laughs> Linda Patterson, hashtag AJB. Thunderbug was on a police boat earlier. Hashtag go bolts. But is he still there, Linda? Where is Thunderbug? Good question. This is th these are the questions. Sophie Marie hashtag KJB hey Hope Kalorn has more jet ski episodes now hashtag Go Bolts. Those jet ski episodes were phenomenal. Yeah, I'm not sure. I feel like he retired for this season, but he might he might do it again, especially with the Stanley Cup on board. I don't think he was actually on a jet ski. I saw him on a boat in that same raised jersey. So I don't think he was switching back and forth, everyone. So perhaps Kalorn on a jet ski with the Stanley Cup will come. I don't think it's happening, though, at least in this moment. I want to point out something here to you folks, because I'm monitoring, we're monitoring comments across three, yes, three social media platforms. Of course, the comments that we're displaying here on your screen are from Facebook Live with the hashtag AJB, hey hashtag hey Gabrielle, or hashtag go bolts. We're also monitoring comments on Twitter, where we're live here as well. We're also, hello there to you, YouTube Live. We wow. see you there in the comment section. I see we have a Gabby here, a Jameson, Chronicle, Justin, Manuel, 
uh, and some others here that are joining us on WFLA now via YouTube Live. Really cool to be streaming to three social media platforms and WFLA.com and the WFLA app. And one of the things that's really cool that I have seen in the YouTube Live comment section here is, man, it's really cool now that the boat parade has not started. This was supposed to begin at 5 o'clock. We thought the boat was going to actually leave the dock here at 5.30. It is now closing in on 5.45. So they haven't left yet, and we don't know the reason as to why they haven't left yet and started making their trek down the Hillsborough River. But if there's one silver lining in this, it's that all the folks that were at work that were unable to to make it to this parade or wondering if they could make it to this parade. If, I'm thinking about all the folks in Pasco County, in Polk County, Pinellas County, that were getting off of work at 5 o'clock. Remember, the Tampa Bay area is more than just Tampa. Of course, we have communities like Lakeland. We have communities up in Pasco County. We have Newport Ritchie. We have, of course, St. Petersburg, uh, you know, across the bay over there in Pinellas County. So all those people that just get out of work, they can now make it, make it in time. There might be in the car right now. Maybe maybe you're in the passenger seat of a vehicle heading over to Tampa right now. It hasn't started. You still have time. So for all those people that are getting out of work now, claim your spot. Uh, this is this is still yet to happen. And while we're waiting here patiently, we can't wait to see the reaction and the smiles that are going to be on thousands of faces here as the cup makes its way down the Hillsborough River. Uh, it could be even thousands more because people are still arriving at this very moment, which is a really cool part of this that uh, we're still waiting. It's now 545. We haven't started yet, but more people are going to see it because it's starting a little bit later. Whether that was by design or not, we don't really know. It doesn't really matter. Sean M. Stutz, hashtag AJB, where does the Perot uh, boat parade uh, start and stop? And it was, um, uh, Paul had it, had it earlier, and I'm trying to bring up my notes here, everybody. Uh, it's going to go past Armature Works. And uh, it stops on, at Rick's on the River, I believe. Rick's on the River, thank you. Yep. Thank you, yes. And, and there it is, is, Rick's on the River. Davis Islands? Yes, I believe. Uh, right in the area of and uh, coming right by us. Here's the, here's the worst part about this, right? Is that we're here and there's a window. You can't see it because I'm in this box here. But right behind me Trust to my me. left and to Gabby's right is the window where the Stanley Cup is going to be coming down we will probably gabby are we gonna get up and leave i mean maybe for like a second just we, ha so we, we might have to say we saw it guys and we, bring you like we're gonna run over to our coverage. window and just see it <laughs> and then we'll come back and then we'll go back just give us a sec it will take us three seconds to get over yeah there. yeah so we'll of course uh stay here with you live from eagle 8 hd but we need to see it for ourselves <laughs> we've been talking about this for for weeks i'm excited full screen again Eagle 8 HD, check out the Tampa Convention Center. Wow. Thousand plus, easy, just at that one location. And then the Riverwalk, right? There's our, there's our tower. There there's our Channel 8 tower right there. That's where we are, Gabby and myself. And then across the way, there's the Riverwalk with the thousands and thousands of fans. Use hashtag AJB, hashtag hey Gabby. Tell us where you're watching from. Uh, we have, of course, people watching from around the world. But maybe by now you're logging on here and you're realizing, well, where's the boat? Where's the Stanley Cup? It was supposed to start at five. Where is the cup? Where's Stammer? Where's Coop? Where's Hedman? Where's Braden Point? All of your favorite players. Well, we want to, we want to, there it is. It's there. It hasn't moved yet. We're not exactly sure why it hasn't moved yet. We're waiting for the boat to leave the dock and make its way down the Hillsborough River. But let us know where you are watching from. Uh, from Courtney on Twitter, 60 boats, hashtag go bolts, hashtag hey JB. Hey, thanks for watching, Courtney on Twitter. Really appreciate it. Jovan McNeil, hashtag ADB, hashtag hey Gabrielle at Fire School watching this right now. Hope I don't get in trouble. Hashtag <laughs> go bolts. Yeah, maybe just kind of sneak it, sneak it if you can. But uh, WFLA News Channel 8's uh, Facebook page, getting this from Twitter, hashtag ADB watching y'all from the press box. Then heading to Raymond James Stadium. Craziness. Love our hashtag go bolts. Everybody watching on Twitter. Hello there to you. And if you're joining us here on YouTube live, WFLA.com, the WFLA app. We, we're streaming in so many different places and so glad to have you with us. Gabrielle Shirley on the right. I'm JB Buno on the left. Don't forget about Eagle 8 HD's Paul Lamison there, there in the is. bottom right. Yeah, he's uh, he's he's. 
cool dude. He's <laughs> way cooler than us. Like, it's not even close. Paul is a uh, man myth legend. Brian on Twitter, hashtag ADB, tuning in from Scotland. Wow. That's cool. Wow. Welcome. That's cool. Welcome from Scotland. Scotland. Really cool. There is the Stanley Cup there, everybody, and the Conn Smythe Trophy there. Imagine how cool it would be to be on that boat. Imagine how cool it I'm would jealous. be. I'm jealous. I want to be there. Michael Johnson, Ashley AJB on the Distant Thunder. I've been following all of this from rural Ohio. Yeah, Michael, we remember you from previous streams. Thanks for joining us here. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Thank you for watching. Uh, Kim McCabe, watching from Maine. Hashtag go bolts. Love it. We'll throw more comments up on your own screen, but you don't want to see us. You want to see the Stanley Cup. You want to see the boat parade, the boat parade that hasn't started yet. The time now for five, uh, excuse me, 548 Eastern time. Matthew Chambers, hashtag AJB watching from the panhandle of Florida. Hashtag go bolts. I used to live not too far away from Pensacola. Thanks for joining us here, Matthew. Teflon Tron. This one, hashtag hey JB, we're live at Armature Works. What's yes. up, Teflon? Armature Works looked very busy. We had a report from Victoria Price there. Looked super fun. Lots of fans. Thank you so much for joining us, Teflon. I, yeah, again, I've been saying this nonstop. If I were not, if I wasn't here with JB, I hope to be out there with you guys because this is history here in Tampa. Here's another comment from Anna Marie Mastrangelo. Gosh, I know I butchered that. Hashtag hey JB, watching from Tarpon Springs. Yes, a little more local there. Love it. We've had people joining us from all across the country, all across the world. Happy to have you guys with us. This celebratory boat parade, as we said, hasn't started yet, but maybe it looked like... Are they getting a little bit farther away from that dock? Oh, man. Maybe? There it is. We are... The it ropes have like been it. undone, and we are off of the dock. For those of you joining us at Amateur Works, if you're joining... Wherever you are joining us from, the Stanley Cup... <laughs> is making its way down the Hillsborough River. There, Stephen Stamkos, Victor Hedman, some other players here that are on the boat itself. Live from Eagle 8 HD Isn't there on the up. right side of your screen. And there's Stammer. <laughs> there's Stammer, everybody. It's amazing. Really incredible. Uh, the parade that has started. It is underway, folks. For those of you just joining us here, on WFLA Now, J.B. Buno, Gabrielle Shirley, thanks so much for being with us. We are streaming to WFLA.com, the WFLA app, our Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube social media accounts to everyone interacting with us there. You can use the hashtag HeyJB, hashtag HeyGabrielle, hashtag GoBolts as well. We'll be uh, throwing your comments up here on screen and, uh, and having a fun time with everybody. A really fun time. Here's a question, a very, very important question from Michael. Hashtag AJB. Any signs of Vazzy? Where's Vazzy? Where is our goaltender? He's there. Haven't seen him yet. But he's there somewhere. Oh, man. We, we, we'll need, to, we'll need to, to get to Vazzy here soon. And we're also looking for that, that pesky Thunderbug. Where is he? He's in there. Like, I spy. Remember the game I spy when you would open up the book and you would have to find that one. Op I'm looking for a Thunderbug in here. I need to know. I need to know that he is that he is safe and okay and ready to have a good time and celebrate with the thousands of Bucks. Or excuse me. Well, Bucks fans too. As Matthew the Bucksman commenting here as well. Hashtag KJB. I'd say I'll say that 80 boats. We think. All right. Over or under 80 boats here. In the parade that is now officially underway. All right, I'm gonna do from a quick. I'm gonna do, try to do a quick count if Paul can zoom out. For maybe me. I'll, I'm gonna pose this to our digital content producer Heather Monahan. Uh, maybe we could like put it in a poll or something. You know how many how many boats are we looking at here? Adam or excuse me, Andy Finley. Hashtag KJB. Hashtag Look Gabrielle. Watch it from Scotland. Oh my gosh! There it is <laughs> on the bow. That looks like Headman. That's certainly Headman. Uh, yeah, great to have Andy uh, watching from uh, Scotland in the UK. Man, we've had some some great viewership from the United Kingdom to all of you over there in the UK. We've had several viewers commenting from Scotland. Really great. Uh, Susan Weidman, hashtag KGB. We are watching from outside Tampa General. Thanks for joining us here, Susan. Getting really excited now that the Stanley Cup is in motion. Hoisted above the head. A Victor Hedman there. <laughs> Getting some photos those players are. Wow, that is so cool. Let's see if we, it's a little bit of a shaky shot, but let's take you here. On the right side of your screen, the Hillsborough River picture that we have here for you. And on the left side of your screen, Eagle 8 
HD. Again, be bringing you... Okay, so this now, as a reminder, we were talking about this earlier. We have land, sea, and air covered here for you on WFLA Now. On the right side of your screen, we have a camera live picture here from one of the boats that's going to be traveling alongside the boat carrying the Stanley Cup. And on the left side of your screen, of course, we have Eagle 8 HD with Paul Lambison aboard uh, tracking everything from the air. And then we have various different camera shots from around Tampa, from on the Hillsborough River to show you some of the crowd reaction that we're going to be bringing you here on WFLA Now. A really uh, a phenomenal joint effort here, team coverage, if you will. Uh, and look at, okay, let's, oh my goodness, look at this shot from Paul. Look at all of these boats. It's awesome. Escorting the Stanley Cup. This is how you do it, Tampa. I think Paul said it best earlier. All you other cities out there, this is how Tampa does a Stanley <laughs> Cup parade. Really cool. And uh, the Stanley Cup, if you're on the Hillsborough River, folks, it is heading your way, leaving fewer than five minutes ago. There it is, the Stanley Cup hoisted high in the air. As Tiana Boer, or Boer uh, commenting here, Hashtag KJB just checked in on Kalorn's page, and he is on a jet ski. This yes! is so awesome. Wish I could be there to celebrate. Hashtag go Bolts. Hashtag hockey fan for life. Hey, Gabby, do you have your phone over there? Maybe is it on, is it maybe on Instagram? Maybe Let's we could, see. Uh, I could put you up on camera. Maybe we could just show it really quickly. Alex Kalorn. In his Tampa Bay. Oh, there is a new part to his story here. Wait, Let's okay. See. I'm going to put you up on camera. Maybe we could, maybe we could show mm -hmm. it for some folks. I don't see a jet ski photo. Here's a shot, everybody, from our, our crew on the water. Checking Twitter. Shell C saying thank you, Channel 8, for this live on YouTube Live for those of you, or excuse me, for those of us that can't attend. So, yeah, Shell C, I, I see your comment. I'm paying attention to the I'm YouTube getting, comments JB. here as well. Thanks for everybody joining us here on YouTube. Here we go. I, I don't think he's on the jet ski, guys. I know we're dying, but this photo was just posted um, by the writer for the Tampa Bay Lightning, and it shows Kaloran standing on a boat taking selfies. <laughs> Love it, man. This is, look at this unbelievable picture. This is live from the skies above Tampa Bay. The Hillsborough River is getting a Stanley Cup parade, a boat parade for the city of Tampa and for the entire Tampa Bay area. Thousands, perhaps even tens of thousands have lined the Hillsborough River here, especially at the convention center and also on the Riverwalk for the boat parade. Again, this all culminating with an enormous celebration at Raymond James Stadium tonight at 7.30. Katie Roberts, hashtag KJB. Hey Thanks for streaming. Watching from Australia, hashtag Go Bolt. How many continents can we cover here? We have a lot of people joining us from around the world and a lot of Lightning fans that are joining us from different sections of the world. And this is a, it's, it's great that we're here because we're normally here streaming, of course, primarily to Tampa Bay, but to be able to stream and make this international a, a real treat for us here. Jason Patterson, hashtag AJB, where are the fishing rods? That's a big, shiny bait bucket. Ha, <laughs> so glad they brought the hardware home. Hashtag go bolts. Yeah, as a reminder, every time you use the hashtag go bolts, we bring down the confetti here, folks. Oh, okay, check this shot out. That is not the Stanley Cup, folks, here. That is an inflatable. <laughs> what? <laughs> but just showing you some of, the, some of the fun going on here on the water. JB, can you tell me what kind of uh, device is that? I want one. That looks like that looks a lot of fun. And now we see some of, the, some of the crowd that has gathered here along the Hillsborough River. Awesome. Oh, here, here's the shot. Here's a shot uh, from, from Paul. <laughs> that, that look, guy that looks like fun <laughs> i want to be on that oh looky looky right there next to the cup that is so cool <laughs> a lot of fun being had here on the water now i want to uh you know i don't know what we're gonna see what we're gonna see as the cup gets closer to the masses to the to all the folks that are uh that are waiting here waiting for the stanley cup to get to their section of the boat parade route before maybe five minutes before we went live 
It was a really cool moment. We had a live picture. Our live picture was just getting set up from the ground, from where they were getting onto the boat, and they were pouring beers into the Stanley Cup, and Steven Stamkos was, was, was lifting up the cup, and people were drinking beer out of the Stanley Cup. Really cool, really cool sight to see. And we might see more of that here, uh, depending on how festive things get. But as you would imagine, it's going to get extraordinarily festive here once the cup gets closer to the enormous crowds that have gathered at the Tampa Convention Center at Armature Works. Where are you watching from? Use hashtag HeyJB, hashtag HeyGabrielle, hashtag GoBolt. Tell us where you're watching from. Facebook Live, Twitter Live, YouTube Live. We want to hear from you. Tell us if you're on the parade route or if you're joining us from somewhere around the world. We want to hear from you. Will Ford Jr., hashtag HeyJB. Thunderbird is on the boat with, or, uh, I think you meant Thunderbug, on the boat with Mayor Caster. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. That's a good duo there. We Great just duo. We spot Thunderbug. We bug Mayor <laughs> Caster all the time, so it's a very fitting. Uh, you see what I did there, folks? Thank you. Thank you. Be here all week. Not really, though. I need a rest. We've been streaming coverage for the Tempe Lightning now for, for many, many consecutive days. Amanda Heffernan, hashtag KJB, watching under the northern boulevard bridge ready to see the cup hey amanda thanks for joining us and i'm sure that you're just as excited as we are really excited of of course for so many of you to be seeing the stanley cup with your own eyes eric share hashtag ajb watching from atlantic city new jersey and my son is watching on the riverside at the university of tampa so hashtag cool. go bolts confetti make it rain Make it rain. There it is. Wow. Look wow, at all those man. Are are you guys this this is cool. We 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 get treated to big boat parades with Gasparilla, but there's just something different about this and how cool this is. Uh let's see here. Mo hashtag AJB I'm watching while in class on Zoom. Hashtag go bolts. There we have we you know it's funny, Gabby. We have a lot of folks here that are supposed to be uh, at work or in class. class or paying attention to something. <laughs> and uh, we're enabling them, but that's okay. I'm here for it. Totally enabling. If you're playing hooky yep. right now, we want to hear from you. Just let us know what you're what you're supposed to be doing. And, <laughs> of course, you're here joining us. And we'll uh, call you out. Lee, Lynette Victoria de Armas. Beautiful, Hashtag beautiful name. Go Bolts. Hashtag make it rain. Make it rain from here, Miami. everybody. Hashtag Go Bolts. <laughs> Love it. It's my favorite animation that we've had shot. here on WFLA now and my favorite shot that we've had here from Eagle 8 HD. Josh Bernard, hashtag go bolts. Drink up me hearties. Yo ho. Yeah. When's Gasparilla? Can it be tomorrow? I'm ready. <laughs> I love Gasparilla. It's pretty much my favorite time of the year. Uh, so much, so much fun. Here's one from Mark Davis. Hashtag KJB watching from the Jungle Prada neighborhood of St. Pete. Wow, great. Thank you for joining us, Mark. This lovely boat parade making its way down the Hillsborough River. So much fun. I wonder if those boys are getting tired of holding the Stanley Cup above their heads. Probably not. They've been rotating. I saw some significant others taking photos, holding it above their heads as well. Really, really cool. Michael then, Patton. Of course, people lining the way. Hashtag AJB watching from my couch in North Carolina. Wish I was on, on a boat on, uh, on the river there. Hashtag go <laughs> bolts. Yeah, Michael. Uh, we, you know, you know, we, it's funny. We, we get, this is a fun assignment for us. Oh yeah. But I think I speak for Gabrielle and myself in saying we would much rather be on a boat right now, too. Uh, very envious of Jeff Patterson, who's our crew on the water here, as Edward uh, wow. Tecampi, hashtag ADB watching from Milwaukee. Hey, Edward, thanks for joining us from good old Milwaukee. Look at this guy. <laughs> uh, Marty St. Louis jersey there, too. Deanna Trednick, or Trednick. Finishing class, watching from Venice, Florida. Hashtag go bolts. That class, Deanna, needs to wrap up soon. Needs to wrap up so you can fully, fully focus. focus. Yep. There you go. Dan Kendall, hashtag ADB, watching from Lakeland. Ooh, thunderstruck. Go bolts. <laughs> yeah, man. I might have to blast some thunderstruck tonight. Not like I've done it 40 times in the last couple of days. Uh, uh, Ina Marie. Hi, Dad Balan, watching from Armature Works. Hashtag go bolts. Hey, thanks so much, Ina Marie, for joining us here. 
Uh, there's your hashtag go bolts confetti just for you. Let's get to this. Uh, the most stunning images we're getting here from Eagle 8 HD, as you would expect, being able to see all the boats that are partaking in this boat parade here. Are they drinking out of the cup? It looks like it. Oh, man. Oh, hopefully we get a we get a close-up shot here to bring you here momentarily, folks. Uh, Jackie uh, Medial, hashtag go bolts from Citrus County, making it rain here again, bringing down the confetti. Where are you watching from? Let us know. Yeah, we want to hear. Here's another comment from Sarah Drews. Hashtag go bolts. Watching from work. <laughs> All of you watching from work and from class. I love it. Yes, this is so much better than probably either of those things. Look at those players holding the cup above their heads. Outstanding. Outstanding. Here's another comment from L. Rancho Tiendas. Hi, we are watching from El Rancho Grocery Store. Hashtag Go Bolts. Hashtag Tampa. Hashtag Boat Parade. Very Lots cool. Of exclamation points. Thanks for joining us. Let's go split screen. Left side of your screen, Eagle 8 HD. The right side of your screen is our boat camera from the Hillsborough River there. And you can see uh, a lot of cameras here on the media boat. The media boat that is following uh, the, the boat that is carrying... Yeah. The Stanley Cup. There's our own Jeff Patterson uh, here as well. And th this is actually getting now very, very close to where we are at WFLA News Channel 8. It's course has to pass the convention center first. Then it makes our way towards us here at WFLA. On the, we're, we have uh, an, um, just an amazing location in downtown Tampa. We are right on the water. When I say that it's really difficult to focus on work, when we can look outside and see people just cruising by on their boats, partying and fishing, it's... It's tough. There's some people around. I see Heather Heather Monahan here. We're all just like cringing because we have a beautiful location in downtown Tampa. But my goodness, there are sometimes we look outside and we're like, man, we oh my god, Get we want to be there. on a boat. We want to <laughs> be on a boat right now. Christopher Cole, here's one for you. Hashtag Hey Gab. Hashtag Hey Gab. I hope they don't drop the cup in the water. LOL. Christopher Cole. Me too. Although, I mean, I just imagine all of them diving in, saving it, and then it being an amazing, like, photo shoot moment type thing. But, yes, let's keep it on the boat. Fingers crossed for that. Here's a comment from Pam Moore, Moore McCoy. Can my kids get a homework pass? We're celebrating the lightning tonight. Hashtag go bolts. Pam, are you guys able to go to the stadium? I wonder if you'll be there. Raymond James Stadium, it was a ticketed event, free tickets. But that is where the Lightning are headed with that cup to celebrate with all the fans. We'll read one more comment here because we're about to bring in Paul Lammas and Rebecca Meeker, hashtag ADB, hashtag Gabrielle. Serious FOMO right now. <laughs> Watching from Loser Town, a.k.a. Dallas, hashtag Go Bolts. Oh, loser it's town. not Loser T. Oh, we, we, you got big round of applause for the Dallas Stars. They made it so close to. It's hard, hard for them to get that that close in the bubble. And oh, thinking about you, Dallas. Thinking about you. It's not you call. I didn't call it Losers Town. I just want to make that perfectly clear. Uh, we have uh, Eagle Eight HD's Paul Lamison joining us uh, from the air here, everybody, with the best view in the house. Hey there, Paul. You having fun up there yet? Paul Lamison in Eagle 8 HD. Do you have us? Maybe third time's the charm. Paul is listening to a lot of different signals in his ear. Let's see if we can, one more time, try to send things over to Eagle 8 HD's Paul Lamison. Paul, do you have us? Hey, JB, I do. Here, take a look at this. They're going by Harbor Island now. That's not the cup. That's just some of the players cruising right by Harbor Island. I'm going to get you a little bit of a wide shot and show that to you. Nice, nice, cool view. Look at that. All the people packed in to wave to the Tampa Bay Lightning, your Stanley Cup champions. Okay, sorry, JB, they had to take me live during the show. But here, I'm going to zoom back in and show you. There's the Stanley Cup. There's Steven Stamkos. There's Victor Hedman. I'm just worried. I, every time they hoist that cup or let other people hoist that cup, I'm hoping don't drop it in the bay. That would be a mess. But we could get it back. I don't think the bay is that bad right here. There they are waving to everybody. This is a cool time. They're, now I'm going to come out wide and show you we're at Harbor Island. That's Harbor Island right behind us. 
There's Yacht Starship with some people out on there waving, saying, hey, Lightning, welcome. Look at that. Packed with people in the blue shirts. Oh, and I'm wearing my Lightning shirt, too, up here in Eagle 8, so if you see me, wave. Now I'm going to move over and show you channel side in the sail pavilion. Everybody ready for it. But there's, they're making their little veer over to Harbor Island. They're going to make it right by there. And I'm going to get you a nice tight shot again. Look at that. How cool is this? What When you have parades up in Chicago and New York and places like that, do they do this? Of course not. This is a boat parade here in the best place, Tampa Bay, Florida. Hey, St. Pete. Hey, Clearwater. Hey, Lakeland. Hey, Winter Haven, Auburndale. You guys are bolts, too. It's the Tampa Bay Lightning, not just the Tampa Lightning. Somebody told me that on uh, social media, so I want to tell them. Oh, this is good. Look, spraying some stuff on the Stanley Cup. This is, this is just great. These guys are having a blast. There's Steven Stamkos, Victor Hedman, the rest of the guys out on different boats. So, JB, this is a fabulous time. Look at this wide shot. This is a postcard. This is beautiful Tampa, Florida. We're at the boat parade, and we'll be up here throughout the rest of the newscast. And come back to me whenever you want, JB. I can't hear you right now, but I'm here for you. Back to you, JB. Eagle oh, and lady. you, Gabby, too. <laughs> Gabby finally followed me on Twitter. Thank you, Gabby. <laughs> <laughs> Man, he is calling me out Man, right now. He, he is. He, he noticed the backstory here to your inside, the inside joke here. Uh, Paul was walking here by, by our stream center and said, and realized that Gabby had just followed Eagle 8 HD on Twitter and on Instagram. Beautiful pictures there, especially on Sorry, Paul's Instagram Paul. account for Eagle 8 HD. And was, Hey, all this time you haven't you haven't followed me the well, Eagle Eight HD Instagram account. For everyone out there, I'm setting a good example. Follow him now. It's never too late. So give him a follow. It, it, I, I normally <laughs> I, I don't like to plug things very much. We're plugging it. But we live in a beautiful area of Florida, and he has the most stunning. He. Does. Takes photography quite seriously. Paul Amazon does. He has the most beautiful shots. He is in that chopper multiple days a week, and he brings us some beautiful pictures. So if you're somebody who loves the Tampa Bay area or loves landscape photos, follow Eagle 8 HD on Instagram. It was a good you move. Won't. I don't regret it. Paul's giving me a hard time for it, but I don't regret it. Loving it. Loving it. And loving Nina Morehouse's comment. Hashtag ADB. I bet this is the first NHL Stanley Cup boat parade ever. We might have to fact check that. We might have to fact check Yeah. That. Has yeah. there ever been a boat parade for the Stanley Cup? Let's get to hear full screen, everybody. You don't want to see us. You want to see the Stanley Cup. You want to see the action here in Tampa Bay on the Hillsborough River in front of the Tampa Convention Center. This is the scene. Uh, I, I, we had a commenter earlier say that it was around 80 boats. Who knows how many it is I think now? It's more than that. I think it's deceiving. It I think it's more very than that. likely be more than and and as far as the amount of people that are here, wow. uh, everybody, I, I want to show know. you this. Oh, Michael uh, Brosh's comment hashtag KGB. I love hockey and the team hashtag Go Bolts. We'll hit the button here hashtag Boom Go Bolts. Wow, what a run! Wow, thanks for being here today. Hashtag Hey Gabby too. Loving it, Thank loving you. it. Hey, Thank you gotta you give shout out. hashtag Hey Paul. Also, he's uh, of course <laughs> monitoring all the action from Eagle Eight HD. But what I really wanted to show you here, as you look here, Travis Floyd hashtag KJB. If the cup, oh no, you can, you can throw it back up here, Heather, if you can. Hashtag KJB. If the cup falls in the water, it'll be okay. It's been in far worse places. We heard some stories the Definitely. other day about it being at the bottom of Not a swimming untrue. pool. <laughs> I don't know if Lord Stanley deserves chlorine or the other <laughs> things that you would find in a uh in a in a swimming pool you guys know what i'm talking about yeah we don't want lord St no uh so but so lord stanley's invincible he can take it totally can i like your attitude let's show you here split screen folks uh this is again from our different pictures and every time i go to the split screen shot and we're uh our camera <laughs> crew is getting a rest for their arm uh, but on the left side of your screen there is look at all the boats from eagle 8 hd on the right side is the media boat that uh, that we are in here as well, and uh, I, I I assure you, two seconds before I hit this button, we had a really cool shot, and then of course I go to the shot, and now we uh, we are looking at the uh, at the adjusting. sky. We'll come back to this. We will come back to this. Getting you back out here full screen, Alexander Kulishov hashtag AJB from. Moscow, a hashtag hey JB from Moscow. I feel honored. Love all you guys. The best team, the best city, and the best people are there. Uh, from Russia with love. 
Man, yeah. I, I'm loving it. Uh, and uh, we hope that you come to Tampa Bay, a beautiful area of Florida, a beautiful place here in the United States. We would love to have you. Maria, hash the KJB from Slovakia watching too. Go Bolts. This is a this is for Maria in Slovakia. This is a confetti just for you. Thanks for thanks for joining us here, Maria. Really, really so so honored to have you here with us. Okay, and now we have that shot. Aaron Greed, hashtag Gabrielle, hashtag JB, hashtag Paul, watching all the way from Arizona. Wish I could be there. Hashtag Go Bolts. Always distant thunder. Okay, now finally, split screen. Eagle 8 HD on the left. And oh. there's our uh, our shot there on the water on the media boat there on the right side of your screen. Uh, one of the jet skis that it's out there on the water. Look at the beautiful Tampa Bay Convention Center. If you have not been to Tampa Bay, this is the area you need to check out. Check out some of the restaurants, the bars. Um, some of the we have phenomenal hotels here that you can stay at here in Tampa Bay. A uh, beautiful area here on the Gulf Coast side of Florida. Hey, there we go. Some pyrotechnics, loving it. That's cool, man. That is so cool. And there's the cup. In the hands of the one, the only Steven Stamkos. As oh, a reminder, gosh, guys, I just can't decide. He's wearing a short sleeve shirt, so that we, might be. Can we solve the mystery? Is the man on the jet ski Alex Kalorn? It's got to be. Oh no, no, there. Okay, no, 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 no. Hold on. I just saw a flicker uh, from yeah, from the championship him. belt. That is Alex Kalorn. We can him. we can say that for certainty now. We you were saw a flicker of the belt, JB. I did. Okay, that's And him. he's wearing a Tampa Bay Rays uniform, and he's also wearing the championship belt. This was him a little bit earlier. I it. I mean, it's, you know, we won the cup and the fans weren't there, but now we get to really enjoy it with them, and that's really what it's about because they're a huge reason why, you know, why we do so well. You're amazing. Thank, Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. And there is the championship belt. So that is Alice Kalorn there on the left side of your screen on the jet ski, the right side of your screen, uh, the <laughs> Stanley Cup. Look at Stammer getting the crowd all into it, man. They've been waiting for this. This is a moment they've been waiting for to celebrate with the fans. 48 hours uh, later, again, it was Monday night in game number six. Gabby called it lightning in six. Lightning in six. I said lightning in five. She said lightning in six. You got to give it to our wonderful sports reporter, Gabrielle Shirley, getting it right. And Is that Bazzy right there? In the white hat? Gosh, it's hard to tell when they have hats and sunglasses on. Is it a clean shaven Andre Vasilevsky? Perhaps. All right, Tampa Bay Lightning fans, we Help are testing out. testing your fanhood here. How diehard are you? We are trying to identify. Oh, look, wait, JB, pause. Is the cup being handed off to the jet ski? Is that what's happening? Is Would they trust that? Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like Alex it. Kalorn and the jet ski is getting awfully close to the boat and the cup. Okay, let's go. Look, there he is. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, my God. Oh, no. He passed. He's passed. Okay, okay. If Yes, it is Kalorn on the jet ski. Kalorn on the jet ski, we can say with 100% certainty. Um, who is there with his fist in the air? I believe that that might be Vasilevsky. Clean, uh, a clean shave and Andre Vasilevsky. trying to get this cup, guys. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's go full screen to Eagle 8 HD. He's on the far side of the boat. Does he have it? No. Yes, no. Patty Meyer, hashtag ADB. Yes, a clean shave and Vazzy. I think you're right. Okay, it's, where'd the cup go? It's very bizarre to see uh, to see Vasilevsky without that. He's usually rocking the facial hair. Uh, Marianne uh, Elfter, hashtag go bolts. The confetti here is for you, Marianne. I think Vassy is on the boat with Cooch. Yeah, I haven't Cooch. seen Cooch. Let's go. Let's go split screen here. Oh, I was just about to hit it. And then our camera crew on the boat. Pivoting shop. <laughs> Sarah Joy Potter, hashtag AJB man. Really wish I had a jet ski right now. Hashtag oh, go sweet. bolt, Sarah. Uh, this, uh, this confetti there for you. Appreciate you joining us here. Again, hashtag hey JB, hashtag hey Gabrielle, hashtag go bolts to uh, have your comment featured here on screen as we have a lot of fun with you here, Tampa Bay, and people joining us from around the world. Sam Leonard, hashtag hey JB. I'm late to the party. Sam, where you been? 
clearly at Epcot here based on your profile picture. <laughs> love to see, uh, love to see, of course, all the families that we're getting here on, on stream because of just their profile pictures. Sarah Joy Potter, hashtag AGB, I love watching you almost as much as I love watching the lightning, hashtag Go Bolts. Oh, that's very sweet. So Sarah, nice, thank, thank Sarah. you. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Jerry Walsh, the one, the only. There he is. Jerry, Jerry, uh, talking about a true, true fan here. Uh, J Jerry, we might have to get you a Bolts jersey. Great coverage, team. Hashtag go Bolts. Jerry, this uh bringing down the confetti for you, buddy. Uh, yeah, we might have to get you a lightning jersey here, Jerry. I don't know where your NHL allegiances lie, but uh, we, might, we might have to get you on board here with the Bolts. Kerry Carr, hashtag KJB. Hey, it's Gordo on the boat. All these different theories are now coming in. We need, to, we need to get some closer shots. Good thing that we have a camera there on the boat, taking you here live, everybody, to our crew on the boat. Again, we're accessing a lot of different live feeds from around the Tampa Bay area on land, sea, and air. Trip Turberville, hashtag ADB number two is Luke Shen. All right, all right, all right. So our, 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 uh, our camera crew here on the media boat. Uh, oh, there's uh, look at some of the law enforcement that's there as well. But we'll get you back out here to Eagle 8 HD. Here's one from Janice. From Janice Wrythe Holesclaw. Hashtag go bolts, baking cookies, and watching WFLA. That is the combination I can get on board with, Janice. Awesome. What kind of cookies? Tell us. I hope chocolate chip. That's my go-to. Love chocolate chip. Love chocolate Big chip. Big fan. Ooh, Ashley Ross, she's back. Hashtag hey JB, you two motivated me. I'm headed down to the river now. Yeah. Hashtag go bolts with some lightning bolt emojis. Yeah. Yes. Go for it, Ashley. Get down there. How often in your life do you get to see the Stanley Cup in person with your franchise, your team winning it all? It's, it's, a, it's a very special thing. Go. You live once. YOLO. Drake. Joy Matthews, hashtag AJB, based on the numbers on the side of the boat. Shen is with Stammer and Hedman. Yeah, I think, I think, that, uh, I think that our uh, eagle-eyed WFLA Now viewers are right on the money here with this one. Look at all the boats in the water. For those of you just, oh, Janice, pumpkin spice chip and chocolate chip. Wow, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that sounds, that sounds pretty good, Janice, loving it. And uh, Richie Kloss, hashtag AJB, lots of excitement. On the Riverwalk, for those of you joining us on the Riverwalk, thank you for joining us here on WFLA Now. Let's bring it back out here, everybody, with our entire team. J.B. Buno here with you on the left side of your screen. Gabrielle Shirley, Paul Lamison is providing you with these stunning aerials here from Eagle 8 HD. So glad to have you with us. If you're watching from Russia, Slovakia, UK, <laughs> Australia, or right here in Tampa Bay, we love having you part of this broadcast, this live stream here, everybody. Uh, so, uh, so thrilled that we have such a unique opportunity here, not just to live stream here this for you, but at the same time, a boat parade, a boat parade for the Stanley Cup. As Paul was noting earlier, uh, we, 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 you wouldn't do this in Detroit, in Seattle. You wouldn't do this in Buffalo or Boston. This is a very, very Tampa-esque treatment for the Stanley Cup, and we couldn't be more happy to have you with us. Use the hashtags you see on the yellow stripes on your screen beneath my name and Gabby's name and Paul's name, hashtag AJB, hashtag hey Gabrielle, hashtag hey Paul. or if you want to make it rain with some confetti, hashtag go bolts here as well. Charles S. Bell watching from Raymond James Stadium, ready for the party out here, hashtag go bolts. Yeah, so I think it's fair to say, as we go back here full screen, everybody, because you want to see, of course, all these boats, I think it's fair to say that the 7.30 start time for the big celebration tonight at Raymond James Stadium is likely going to be a little late. Uh, and uh, it's, it's be likely. Yeah, because the Stanley Cup is still on the water. Look at this, guys. They are actually, I kept looking away from the stream because these boats are getting closer to where we are at WFLA News Channel 8. Our station is located right on the water, so I kept looking out to the right, our big windows, to see if I could see any boats. I'm told that the boats are approaching. Very, very exciting. I might be tempted to step away for three seconds so I could snap a photo and just see it with my own eyes, give you a more authentic feel of exactly what's going on. Oh, yes, and I believe Joy Matthews. I didn't realize that at first. The boats with the players have their numbers located on the side of them. Big blue 
signs with white numbers. Oh, that's excellent. Because like I said, I was having a tough time at a distance deciding who was who when they're wearing hats and glasses. Here's a comment from John Kruger. Hashtag Hey JB. Hashtag Hey Gabrielle. Watching from PA. Yes. While I'm out on an evening walk, wishing I was in Tampa. Hashtag Go Bolts. Hashtag Being the Distant Thunder. Yes, John, I believe I already mentioned this to you, but I'm also from Pennsylvania. So I love to hear that. Pennsylvania, that's my home. I'm from Philadelphia, that side. Here's a comment from Patty Meyer. Hashtag Hey JB, has anyone spotted point number 21? Hashtag Go Bolts. Ah, uh, Patty, you know what? I haven't. Obviously, all of the players are there. Um, it's just a matter of how close we can get to faces and then to numbers that are located on the sides of those boats. So I see a lot of them with the numbers on the side. Here's a comment again from Josh Bernard. Raymond James Stadium has painted go bolts in the end zones. Wow, that's a nice touch. Josh, I will be there later. Can't wait to see it. Get some photos, get some video. That's really, really cool. Corey Milliken, Ashley AJB Headman, got on Killer's jet ski with the cup. Did, wow. did that happen? I, I've been I've been looking around at some different feeds. Is that uh I did that in fact happen? Definitely left that big boat that it was originally on. I thought it was on the jet ski, but I didn't see exactly who, where, where it went, etc. So we're gonna have to look for that jet ski because it has a big silver, shiny, beautiful Stanley Cup on it. There's the crowd along the river walk. Oh my god. Really special. Really special. Uh, the river walk, a, a unique feature here in Tampa Bay. Uh, we, we, joggers, uh, bicyclists will, uh, of course, uh, a lot of exercise uh, taking place on the river walk every day. It's just one of the, the, the best areas of our city and really, really awesome to see it jam packed today. Uh, instead of people, of course, running and on their bikes, uh, we have just crowds of people that are on it uh, getting ready, of course, for the arrival of the Stanley Cup. Very, very cool. Take a look. There's the main boat where the cup started. I definitely do not see it. I see the Conn Smythe Trophy, which is what Victor Hedman won, MVP of the playoffs. So, yes, the Stanley Cup is – we got to find it. That's our Where's, Where's Waldo right now because, yes, we believe that it got on a jet ski with perhaps Kalorn and Victor Hedman, but I do not see that jet ski. It looks like maybe – Paul Lamison in Eagle 8 HD is trying to find it as well. Lots of boats, lots of people out on the water there. Lots of helicopters, too. Lots of helicopters. <laughs> Sherry Bartell has to get to be the cup, is on the jet ski with Killer. Yeah, we need to pass Where that along. Where is as well. that jet ski is the question now. Let's see. I, I want to. Uh, some. It's kind of funny because sometimes Paul is on a different frequency and we're not able to reach him, but let's try to check in with Paul. Hey, Paul, do you have us here on WFLA now? Okay, I don't think Paul is on our frequency, but I would like it, it'd be fun to uh, to track down, of course, a lot of these players that people are talking about here as well. Cynthia Miller has to get to be watching as I'm at work at Publix. Hashtag <laughs> go bolts. Hey, Cynthia, that's for you. Bringing down the confetti. Look at all the boats here. Look at the convention center. Yeah, as expected. If you're on the river walk right now, if you're at Armature Works or uh, elsewhere on the Hillsborough River, uh, this was expected. The boat coming up to the Tampa Convention Center and just kind of hanging out for a bit. They weren't going to breeze past the Convention Center with thousands and thousands of no people way. here uh, waiting to see the Stanley Cup. So they're they're taking a moment here. Uh, maybe they're passing the cup to different boats or, or on the jet skis we noted with one of our commenters earlier uh, to ensure that everybody has an opportunity to really cherish this moment. You don't want this moment to be over. If you're at the Tampa Thank Convention you. Center, maybe... Oh, there's Paul uh, talking to our broadcast hey, team. Hey, can we'll you guys see. check? Do you want us to go get fuel now? Oh, running out of fuel in Eagle 8 HD. So we'll, uh, we'll, we will have multiple different camera angles here to show you as well. In fact, we, we are, I'm going to see if we can bring up one particular shot that we have right now. Stand by here, folks. Juggling a lot of feeds here all in real time. But here we go from the boat. Ooh, the signal breaking up here a little bit, but there is the cup being hoisted for all the fans at the Tampa oh, there it is. Convention okay, it's Center. Back. And you're right, that's Luke Shen, Victor Hedman, Steven Stamkos, the numbers on the side of that boat. All right, so Eagle needs to f refuel, and uh, it's going to land, refuel, as quickly as possible, get back up in the air. 
Uh, we've been in the air now for an extended period of time. Mark Davis, Hash the KGB, as an old Marine, I love seeing Stanley going amphibious. <laughs> love it. Mark Davis, hashtag go bolts. As we look here at, uh, at just the celebration. It, it, the only thing that's missing is the confetti in real life. But you know what? Good thing we have virtual confetti to bring you here, folks. Because, uh, uh, my goodness, the parade. I, I prefer a boat parade. I think this is, this is the best Tampa parade that we have had. I, I love Gasparilla, but this is, just, this is just so special to celebrate this with everything that's gone on in 2020. 2020 has sucked. Can we just say that? 2020 has sucked. And this is a really, really bright spot for the city of Tampa and for the entire Tampa Bay area. Ashley uh, Ventry, hashtag go bolts. Look like the trophy is back with Stammer. Hashtag yes, go bolts. Loving it. Back with the captain. Here's a comment from JR Quills. Quiles, excuse me. Hashtag KJB. Stuck at home in Wesley Chapel, but watching the parade on WFLA. Hashtag go bolts. Ah, yes, happy to have you here. Happy to be able to bring this to you. So special, these boys, like, holding it above their heads. Ah, amazing. Here's a comment from Dave Cutler. Hashtag KJB, hey hashtag hey Gabrielle. Thanks for bringing the Stanley Cup championship celebration to those of us who can't be at the Riverwalk. Hashtag go bolts. Hashtag Stanley is getting a tan. Yes, Dave, you are welcome. It is a privilege and an honor. We are happy to be here with you watching all of this unfold and taking all of these really cool shots. JB is controlling all of that, doing a great job with it. This is from a media boat. Um, our photographer is on it, filming all of this. Eagle 8 HD is taking a quick break to refuel. We'll have that back up hopefully soon for you guys. And yeah, look at this. Look at all of those people. Wow. Just lining there, si sitting there, watching, lining that area, watching this cup pass by they're going rather slowly just so they can get as much quote-unquote interaction with these fans from the water as they can really really cool really special forgive us when this shot gets a little pixelated a little glitchy that's just the connection out there lots of photographers on that boat as well there is, uh, is there that he a is, stammer. I think that's a cigar uh, a very well-deserved victory yeah, there it is Definitely. the victory cigar with Steven Stamkos and the Conn Smythe Trophy there in the hands of its winner, Victor Hedman, the defenseman, of course, for the Tampa Bay Lightning. How cool this is to be live on a boat. Oh, yeah, so remember, cool. remember that music video, everybody? I'm on a boat <laughs> while we're on a boat with a camera bringing you Stanley Cup boat parade coverage here. And uh, Mark Adam, maybe, as you would expect, he's been with us every stream. Mr. Hashtag Hey JB. I'm tuning into the party. There's our tower. That's where we are. <gasps> you see that tower there? Oh, okay. So Eagle, that, that's the shot that's from Eagle, Eagle where it just refuel. You're going to see the Eagle, uh, excuse me, the Channel 8 tower there in, in the distance. And that is, of course, uh, where we are. So we're not, we're, uh, there's a window right there. I, I can't watch? wait. When can I go watch? I can't wait. We, we're going to take turns, right? Okay. okay so you that's go. Fair. I can go now? To the window. Well, I don't well think, no, it's not there yet. Not there yet. Okay. But when it gets here, you go to the window, <laughs> right? <laughs> And then I'll stay here with our viewers. Okay. And then we'll you come back and we'll switch. We'll switch. And viewers, then we can run to the window. That's okay with you. We'll Lydia, Mc, Lydia McHenry has to get to be where's the parade. All us armature peeps are wondering. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. Liddy, pass. Slowly get the word out. but surely. And Liddy, t if you want real time coverage of where it is, get Tell people to tune in to WFLA in. now and hang out with us uh, because uh, this doesn't get any more real time than this here, folks. Um, and I believe that we have access to, and I wanna, I'm going to switch some things around here, folks. Excuse me. I'm going to hit some buttons. Oh, Christopher Cole. Let me read this comment real quick, JB. Hashtag yep. go bolts. Yes, it was on the jet ski. Shout out. This is my favorite part. To Steve Andrews on his retirement. Christopher Cole. Yes, I will pass that message along to Steve Andrews. He is Very retiring. Special. Has retired. Um, we celebrated him today, honored him, and it was really special. Very special. Uh, to have Steve in, and I, I, for the first time in six months, I got to speak with Steve and, uh, in person rather. And it was just so great. Um, Steve, of course, a legendary, and I mean that in every sense of the word, legendary, uh, investigative journalist here at WFLA, father of Aaron Andrews, who you might recognize from Fox sports, uh, of course, Sunday night football, uh, dancing with the stars. Uh, and, and to have Steve retire after a legendary investigative journalism career, 
uh, it, it's just when when people when I talk to people about where I work at WFLA, they go, "Oh, that you you work with Steve Andrews?" And I said, "Yes, yes, <laughs> Steve we do. Andrews." I work, so he retired today. Mm. Huge shout out to Steve. Um, might just be the nicest guy. In this entire newsroom, I, I mean that. Never, I wouldn't. I would not embellish yes. in and that in that regard. Also, a Tampa Bay Lightning fan because of course Big that's Bolts where fan. Aaron Andrews got her start. That's right. So the, you're Fox Sports. You, you, you interested, Gabby? Because uh, if, if Aaron can do it, you can do it. <laughs> Big things ahead for our own Gabrielle Shirley here, folks. Uh, uh, Mo. Hashtag AJB. How do you think all other teams feel while we are on the boat parade? Hashtag go bolts. Yes, without a doubt. Yeah, no. If, if, my goodness, this is how you party. <laughs> this is how you have a good time. How do it. And I want to let, uh, as we get the Janice Longs come in here, hashtag AJB, hashtag hey Gabrielle, ha uh, hanging out in Riverview, Riverview, but wish I was on the river walk. Uh, raise next, hashtag raise next, then bucks. For the trifecta, hashtag go bolts. I'll do you one better. Should give a raise update. I'll do you one better. Yeah, let's go. As as you bring up the raise update, I want to point out. Uh, let's let's go back here to the shot, the boat shot. I want to bring up something very very important. Okay, let's talk about the four major sports organizations that there are here in the United States: MLB, NBA, NHL, NFL. Okay, we have the cup, right? Florida has the cup. We have the cup. The Rays are the number one seed in the American League and looked great winning last night. Right now, JB, in winning. Game two, eight to two, top of seven. Okay, so they're about to get out of the wild card round if the score holds oh, and yes. get to the ALDS, the divisional <laughs> series. Okay, we've got the greatest quarterback ever in Tom Brady, and the Bucks are really starting. And here's the exciting thing about the Bucks the defense for the Bucks really starting to show what they are capable of. Unreal. And, uh, our friends down in South Florida, you might have heard of them, the city of Miami, they've got the heat in the NBA Finals. Without a doubt, an uphill battle against LeBron James and the Lakers. But we're talking about a really exciting time for sports here in the state of Florida. Could it happen? Could Miami beat the Lakers? Could the Rays get a World Series? Could Tom Brady get the Vince Lombardi trophy here for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers? After we have the Stanley Cup here in a boat parade, after the Tampa Bay Lightning won the Stanley Cup in Edmonton, man, exciting times ahead. Exciting times. I, I am certainly dreaming here. But you know what? That's the best part about sports. You can dream. I'm also paying very, very close attention to the YouTube Live comments there. Uh, YouTube Live, we see you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to shout out some names that have been hashtag hey Gabrielle, hashtag hey JB, like crazy in the comment section there. Jameson Terry, see ya. Uh, Sue Stewart is watching from Beaver River in Pennsylvania. Thanks for joining us here. Chuck Jim uh, was, had the hashtag hey Paul a little bit earlier on. And uh, Keith Conley, hashtag hey JB, thank goodness. Uh, lightning strikes twice, hashtag go bolts, thanks for the stream. Brian Ferguson, hashtag ADB, watching from North Carolina, missing Tampa Bay, especially during a Stanley Cup win. So we've lost Gabrielle. It's just me. It's just me. Gabrielle, just <laughs> without word, just sprinted towards the windows here at WFLA because the Stanley Cup is on a boat passing our station right now at this very second. And so I have lost my broadcast partner, my live stream partner, uh, because the Stanley Cup is way cooler than me, and I am totally okay with that. Back here live to you here, folks. Full screen here from the boat. And uh, we also have now, check this out. So remember we were showing you our broadcast tower there a little bit earlier on, the broadcast tower that we have here at WFLA News Channel 8 in downtown Tampa? We have a camera up there, and that is a live picture from our WFLA tower cam. And you're going to see the... Uh, the Stanley Cup passed by here in moments, moments away. Thunder roared, lightning struck. Some of the signs that we're seeing here from the, from along the river, the Hillsborough River here. And we're going to get to some more of your comments here momentarily as well. 
waiting for the tower cam to capture the Stanley Cup right by WFLA News Channel 8. Ken, uh, Kenny Babcock, hashtag AJB watching from Houston, Texas. Again, for those of you just joining us, hashtag AJB, hey hashtag hey Gabrielle, hashtag go Bolts. If you want to have some fun with us and have your comments spotlighted here on screen and wishing the Bolts uh, a big congratulatory uh or just big congratulations patty meyer hashtag ajb watching from st pete hashtag go bolts here's a great shot here uh we have a shot here from the river walk oh we did and uh, there you see all the people lined up liliana cambronero cross hashtag ajb hashtag hey gabrielle watching from costa rica great job guys Hashtag go bolts. Liliana, that's for you. Thank you for joining us here on WFLA now. I'm back. Gabrielle is back here, TV, everybody. Go see it, All right, now I'm gonna go. Did you see it? Yeah, I saw it. Quick, go. Okay, I'm gonna go check out the Stanley Cup here. yet but hashtag hey jb hashtag hey gabrielle this boat parade may be a start of a cool new tradition yes i agree props to whoever thought of it excellent idea so florida so tampa so exciting for this team this city look there's the cup right there again floating by our station happy to be here with you wish i could be outside wish i could be on a boat that would be even better i saw a media boat pass by our own jeff patterson is on that boat as well as a photographer just filming all of the action we've been giving you that's the feed actually right now that we are giving you again because our helicopter eagle 8 hd is getting some fuel take a look though steven stamkos luke shen victor hedman and then there we go. The Stanley Cup is in the air. Wow. So special. So many people lining the entire way. It's awesome. It's awesome. Everyone is bustling by me. You can't see me right now, but going over to the window so they can get, see it, see it in action, not through this camera. <sighs> so cool. Join us if you're watching this. Let us know where you are, how you're watching this boat parade. If you're out there, tell us how is it? How are all the fans? Is everyone so excited? What's happening? If you're in your homes, let us know where you're watching from. We've had people from all over the United States, all over the country, all over the world joining us. Happy to be here with you. Wow. The Stanley Cup floating right by our station here at WFLA. Oh, we have a comment from Dave Cutler. Hashtag, hey, Gabrielle, fan of the hashtag Bolts since day one in Expo Hall. Though the then Thunderdome, now to Amelie Arena, watching from Seminole Heights. Hashtag, go Bolts. Hashtag, Stanley is getting a tan. Absolutely. Dave, thank you so much for joining us. Dave Cutler. Oh man, so special, this boat parade, slowly but surely making its way down the river, headed to Armature Works. There are people there, I believe our own Liddy is there. She's been joining us every night we've been on the stream. So grateful to her for tuning in. She was wondering where this boat parade was. Again, it's getting there, it is getting there. Moving slowly so these players can interact with these fans. There's Victor Hedman asking everyone to raise the volume. Here's a comment from Kelly Goss Tartaro. Hashtag hey JB, hashtag hey Gabrielle. Watching from Northdale. Wish I could be downtown. Hashtag go bolts. 
Okay, we have some more players there. Oh, my goodness. So exciting. Here's a comment from Terry now. Hashtag HeyJB watching from Winnipeg, Canada. Hashtag love the bolts. Back here, everybody. And we have a, a new picture here, everybody. This is from our roof cam now. Wow, Check this out. Jim Farquhar on the camera, our WFLA photojournalist here, who shoots uh, Better Call Bankin. Jennifer Adams, hashtag AJB, distant thunder here in Philly, missing Tampa Bay tonight. Thank you for the celebration coverage. Philly. Hashtag go bolts, hashtag Philly for Brady. Yeah, Tom Brady, TB12 here okay. in Tampa Bay. JB, I'm getting news that we have a shot from Armature Works, ENG7, everyone. Sorry, that's a technical term for us, <laughs> Victoria Price. <laughs> no one knows what ENG7 means unless that you wasn't work for here. You guys. That was just for JB. It's a feed number. It's a feed number for us to switch over to. Let's show you what ENG7 is all about here, folks. Uh, actually, you know what? Hold on. We're going to stay on this for another moment just because this is a cool it's shot. It's so good. It is so good. I think I know that boat. I think that's my friend's boat. I think I see that. I know that boat. Really? Yeah, I'm pretty confident. Uh, Amy uh, Bodenheimer Watson, hashtag ADB, still so happy for, for you, for me. Why? You have been on <laughs> uh, on here giving us all kinds of happy news and polls. I'm really so happy for you. Oh, a Amy, thank so you. Nice. It's I, WFLA now is about you guys, not about me, but uh, really, really appreciate it. Look at this shot, Amy and Gabby. Look at all those people. Wow. And now another shot. Look at this. There is the Stanley Cup. There it is. For all of the fans. Stammer. <laughs> okay. Also, everyone, I got a close-up of this because I was wondering. I, like, need that hat. It says Champagne ca Campaign. That is the hat Steven Stamkos is wearing right now. As well as Luke Shen. He has a white one. I like the white one, too. I need it. Heather's been buying gear. Heather, can I get that hat? Look at this. Steven Stamkos. I have Hoist in the cup in downtown Tampa. All right, everybody, we want to let you know that we are now engaging a new digital audience here on WFLA now. JB Buno, Gabrielle Shirley here with Hi. you. Okay, so we're now, we have now a couple of different Facebook live streams going. We're also streaming to Twitter and to YouTube live as well. But if you want your comment featured here on screen, you need to go to the most recent Facebook live. So we now have Facebook lives going in multiple places. We're streaming to our app, our website. YouTube and Twitter as well, but we just went live to a new Facebook Live audience. Hello there to you, JB Buno, Gabrielle Shirley here with you. Glad to have you with us. Yes. Let's go full screen. This is what you want to see, this the cup itself. <laughs> and if you use the hashtag, hey JB, that hashtag, shot. hey Gabrielle, hashtag go bolts, we it's can phenomenal. put your comment up on screen. So really wow. happy to have you here with us for this one of a kind view, a boat parade in <laughs> hockey. <laughs> Yeah, the Stanley <laughs> Cup being hoisted high above the head of Steven Stamkos here for all the thousands of people that have now lined the Riverwalk here in downtown Tampa. So cool. Look at this shot. You wonder how many people are down here? This is just what we could fit in this one camera view. Wow. Look at them amazing. going crazy. It's amazing. Going wild. And we uh, have another camera now down the river here a bit. Uh, that we're going to bring you here once that... Once the cup gets closer to the camera shot, more down the river. Stacy Wells cutting. Hashtag go bolts. Yeah, if you use the hashtag go bolts in the comment section and we see it, that's what we do. We bring down the virtual confetti. We don't have real life confetti here in Tampa Bay because that's, of course, for a more of a ticker tape style parade, you know, in let's say a northern city such as New York or Detroit or Chicago or Boston. But we have a boat parade. So we're bringing down the virtual confetti. To, uh, to bring the ambiance, so to speak. David, hashtag AJB, hey hashtag go bolts from channel side again. No getting through downtown Tampa. So many folks be in the thunder. There's no doubt about it that this is a, uh, a bit of a, of a traffic nightmare. But you know what? It, it's more of a, it, it's not a traffic nightmare. Let's call it a traffic dream come true here for downtown Tampa uh, because this is, this is the best reason to have traffic. It's because that there's so many people flooding the downtown Tampa area for a Stanley Cup celebration. Christina Emery, hashtag go bolts. Only Florida does a Stanley parade on a boat in flip flops. <laughs> that is true. That oh. is true. Is that really true? Well, guys, we have some pretty exciting news here for you. I got to hit some buttons. Got to hit some buttons. And there we are back with Eagle 8 HD. Beautiful. Yep. 
refueled and back up, ready to go. There is the Stanley Cup being hoisted here on the Hillsborough River. We're going to get to Paul Lamison in Eagle 8 HD momentarily as Freedom Lang. Hashtag Go Bolts. Pretty exciting stuff, folks. Pretty exciting stuff. It never gets old, JB. I love it so much. Here's a comment from Kit or KT? Kit? No, this is Kit. Kit. Yeah, Hashtag I think it's Kit. Go Bolts. I'm sorry, guys. My contacts are like glazing over here because I'm just staring at this screen. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Check out this shot <laughs> oh, here. There. 88. Who's that, guys? Doesn't get much cooler than this. Jennifer Carly, Deval Perez, hashtag go bolts. Stamkos kissing the cup. I believe that's Stamkos. Yes, that's Stamkos that there. Stammer. Just have to triple check. Yep. Two cups on the bottom of your screen. 2004, 2020. <laughs> Doesn't get much cooler than that. Yeah. Again, JB Buno, Gabrielle Shirley here with you live on WFLA Now. You can use the hashtag HeyJB, hashtag HeyGabrielle, or hashtag Hey, or excuse me, hashtag GoBolts to have your comment featured on screen. Want to hear from you? Again, using one of those hashtags. And uh, got a lot of different pictures here to show you folks. Let's check out this picture here. We'll, we'll go split screen here for you. Uh, and we'll get to Jeff's comment here in just a moment. Eagle 8 HD on the left. Uh, our Hillsborough River camera shot there on the right. So you're getting a shot from the air and from the sea. Here, everybody, on WFLA now. As there is the Stanley Cup on a boat. <laughs> we need to find out if this is the first ever boat parade in the history of the Stanley Cup. Probably not. Oh, look, there we go. So there we go. Pouring beer into the Stanley Cup and uh, drinking away. That's the captain right there having That's a drink. That's the captain having a drink. Let's go full screen here on the right side of your screen from the Hillsborough River shot. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Big applause for the captain. That is amazing. Steven Stamkos here. Awesome. So cool. Very, very cool. Here's a comment from Jeff Pella could Dovsky will go with. Hashtag That's very good. That was a very good pronunciation. HJB watching from Buffalo. Hashtag Distant Thunder. Hashtag Go Bolts. Heather Monahan is cheering about Buffalo. And he has a Bills jersey on. Got it. Look at that in the profile picture there. That was pretty awesome. Uh, more beer. More beer. More beer. Karen Robinson Willard. Hashtag ADB watching from Canada. Timmins Canada. Where's Vazzy? Hashtag Go Bolts. I saw him. I saw number 88 on a boat, so he is nearby. I haven't actually seen his face yet, but he is close. They, all of the players, they're split up. Um, they, you know, can't really all fit on these size boats, especially with their significant others on board. So just look for the numbers. The numbers on the boats tell you who is on board. Yes. Drinking yes. beer, having fun, hoisting the Stanley Cup. Eh. No big deal. <laughs> Said nobody in the stream comment section. Uh, Krista Dees Cordero, hashtag go bold. Straight, great job, boys. Well-deserved win. Welcome back to Tampa. Couldn't agree more with Krista's comment. Welcome, Welcome home. home, boys. <laughs> Kathy Marino Jeffries, hashtag go bold. Wish we could be there watching from South Jersey. Hashtag hey JB, hashtag hey Gabrielle, and hashtag hey Paul. Paul Lamison and Eagle 8 HD. Let's try to check in with Paul if we can. Paul Lamison, of course, WFLA's chief photo journalist, and he is in the sky once again after refueling nearby here in downtown Tampa. Let's see if we can check in with Eagle 8 HD's Paul Lamison. Paul, I know you're on several different frequencies. Do you have us? Hey, GP, I do. Welcome back to me. It's good to see you and hear you, and we're still over the Stanley Cup. Look at this. We just got done watching Stamkos and Victor Hedman drinking out of the cup. We'll say they were drinking water, but they had stuff in the cup. That was pretty funny. They're cruising up now. Here, I'm going to pull out wide and show you where we are. We're still making the way up. We're going right underneath the bridge, the Punisher Bridge. That's the one that goes right by the... Uh, Straws Center over by University of Tampa is right over there. It's getting ready to come up to Julian B. Lane Park. So they're on their way to Rick's. They still got a, they got a little ways to go. 
little over halfway done, but this has been a fantastic parade. There's tons of people lined on the river walk, and we're coming up to um, Armature Works, and there's even more people there. They're about to go under the bridge now. They have the Stanley Cup back out. There they are hoisting it. There you go. There's a good shot. That's just quality stuff. This is a big deal for these guys, an even bigger deal for the city of Tampa, St. Pete, Clearwater, Lakeland, Auburndale, uh, down in Manatee County. These are the Tampa Bay Lightning, and everyone's proud of these guys. There's the cup up as they go under the bridge in the big celebration boat parade. They're about to make it under, and when they do, they're going to go right by the river walk on the Straws. There's the Straws Center, some people out there, and everyone coming out to support the Lightning. Lots of players. They're all on different boats. And there's media. There's a media boat. Here, I'll show you a couple of the boats. Another media boat. Jeff Patterson's on one of them. There's uh, Vassie's boat. There's Vassie in the back of the boat right there. And they're not giving him the cup. If I was him, I'd be like, hey, give me the cup. You know I won't drop it. I, I shut out the uh, Dallas Stars in the last game. Give me the cup. But there they go down along right by the Straws Center. I'm going to pull out wide and show you just how beautiful this is. Look at this. If you live in another city and you're watching this, you should be really jealous of us here in Tampa. Right now it's in the 70s. It's beautiful. Nice sunset coming up. And this is just the beginning. We're still going to go to Raymond James Stadium and have a party inside Raymond James with the Lightning players. And then, here, I told you this before and I'm going to tell you again. The Lightning have the cup, and they keep the cup until, well, they're going to keep it next year when they win it. But the players, each player gets to take the cup with them home and have their own special day with the cup. So it might show up different places around town in Tampa. So if you're out and about, and you might see the Stanley Cup. There it is. There's Steven Stamkos kissing the cup, holding it up. This is a huge highlight for his career. Nobody knew if he was even going to come back and make it. He goes into the Stanley Cup. His first shot is a goal. That stuff legends are made out of. That that was just a super cool moment for him. But there he is, soaking it in, holding the Stanley Cup, kind of like uh, the scene from the Titanic, except even better. There, holding the cup up on the bow of the boat. There's Victor Hedman. Shh cheering for the other crowd. There's more players over on this boat, people dancing. This is a great time for the Tampa Bay Lightning. This is how they are going to remember this cup. And this is going to go down in Tampa Bay history. Hey, remember the time the Lightning had the parade down the river with the Stanley Cup? And now what we don't want them to say is, oh yeah, then uh, Steven Stamkos dropped it in the water. No, we don't want them to do that. So JB, this is a fun night. We still have a little ways to go here. I'll show you where we're going. I'm going to move the camera out. Right now, this is coming up on, there's uh, Tampa Prep. There's Julian B. Lane Park. Here's the bridge right up that goes. We go under the interstate. Now you're going to get a cool shot of the camera. We're going to go up to Waterworks Park. There's Eulalie. And then here is armature work. So they're not even up to the line of armature works. Look at that. This is just fun. They're waiting. They're having a good time. This is Tampa Bay Lightning hockey. There's somebody with the fake Stanley Cup right there. I think that one's made out of beer or beer cans. There you go. He's got the cup. So I'm going to move it out wide again and show you where they're going to end up. There's Armature Works. They still have to go up this part of the river. Okay, we're going to go to the pre-show, JB. So I'll show you Armature Works. And there's Ricks on the river. There's where it's all going to end up. So, JB, I'll throw it back to you because I now have to work for a living. I love doing this uh, WFLA now, the best thing around on the internet. So JB, I'll throw it back to you. Go Bolts!
Eagle 8 HD's Paul Lamison joining us from the sky above the Hillsborough River there in downtown Tampa, providing us with these stunning aerial views. And again, a big shout out to the one and only Paul Lamison. You see there is uh, his picture on the left side of your screen. He's our WFLA chief photographer, and he is a very, very very talented aerial photojournalist here been doing this for a very long time and he's been waiting a long time gabby to celebrate this as is our fans joining us from around the world here on wfla now uh sandy clark watching from arkansas hashtag go bolts every time you use the hashtag go bolts we bring down the confetti here for you folks uh and uh and again, you can use hashtag HeyJB, hashtag HeyGabrielle to join us. Hey, here's a name you might recognize, Gabrielle. Oh, I do recognize this name. Colleen, she is my boss. Um, <laughs> Boat Parade is best parade. Hashtag HeyGabby, hashtag HeyJB, hashtag HeyPaul. Colleen, thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate it. And yes, a Boat Parade is the best parade. We agree. Got to make the boss happy. Got to put her comment on screen. <laughs> she comments, it goes on screen. Always. That's how that's how it works Without here. And uh, again, we're throwing up comments from the most recent Facebook live stream. We have two of them going simultaneously right now, in addition to a Twitter stream and also a YouTube live stream. But if you want your comment featured on screen, you have to use the hashtag HAB, hashtag Hey Gabrielle, or hashtag Go Bolts from the most recent Facebook live stream. Shelly Foriello, what a great day for Tampa Bay. Watching from Zephyr Hills, hashtag Go Bolts. Man, look at this. Going underneath the bridge They're here. Funneling through, yeah. Yep. Uh, Catalin Wenmark, hashtag Hey JB, hashtag Hey Gabrielle, hashtag Hey Paul. I've followed the Bolts since they came into existence. Couldn't be more proud of these guys. The growth of this team over the last 16 years has been a pleasure to watch hashtag go bolts it's from uh from Catlin Wenmark here thanks for joining us here uh Catlin or excuse, I think that was Caitlin let's yeah. try that again Caitlin Wenmark thank we'll you Caitlin that, for Caitlin. joining us man they're making their way everyone yes what a great progression there just funneling through getting under that bridge headed towards Armature Works, and then, of course, Raymond James Stadium. Wow. Let's get to this comment Olivia here. Livingston, hashtag AGB. My boyfriend is a charter captain and has some of the Bolt players on his How boat. Cool. Okay, so that's really cool. And I, I have a story to tell. I have some family members here in Tampa Bay that, uh, as I have a Superman curl coming down here, uh, that have a boat. And uh, because if you have a boat and connections, you get access to some some really some really really cool people during Gasparilla time, and uh, let's just say that uh, that I, I have some family members who have had some some celebrities on their boat. Uh, wow. Really really cool. Big big. My family is big Yankee fans. They've had Tino Martinez on their boat. Uh, I can't think of all the other names right now, but having a boat and connections in Tampa Bay is a really cool thing. And. I'm not surprised that we have uh, some folks here joining us saying that they uh, have friends who are, or family members who are charter captains who have some lightning players on their boat. Because, listen, someone has got to provide the boats, right? <laughs> uh, Mary Brian, hashtag go bolts, bringing down the confetti here. Uh, you know, one of the things, too, that I want to point out to our, our viewers here. So the aerial view is a bird's eye view. We're looking directly down right now from Eagle 8 HD here in the center of your screen. Uh, what you can't see from this vantage point is how gorgeous we have some of the most beautiful sunsets here in tampa bay in all of the world and we are getting to that point now we're getting to sunset time here we're getting uh, uh the time just switched over to seven o'clock eastern here and uh here from you'll start to see it here on this particular shot uh once i do in fact have it and i think i can take it here now but you'll start to see some of the very very cool lighting that we're going to have here as the stanley cup makes its way down uh, down the Hillsborough River here. This is a live picture from Armature Works. For the fans that have been waiting so patiently at Armature Works, it's getting closer. This is a live picture from Armature Works. And <coughs> excuse me. God bless you, can, you. Thank you. You can start to see. Uh, you can start to see. There's the Stanley Cup right there in the center of your screen. And this is from Armature Works. Here's a comment from Elizabeth. From Elizabeth Arocho, hashtag KJB. Tampa has the most beautiful downtown. Proud to live here. Thank you, Tampa Bay Lightning. We needed this. Go Bolts. Woo! Yeah, I agree. And yes, Stanley Cup right in the center of your screen there. 
<laughs> making their way <laughs> down. Oh, my Justin goodness. Matthews, hashtag you to be watching from Misawa, Japan. Wishing I was home. Hashtag go bolt. And, and if we could leave this on screen for another second, uh, Amazon's The Boys. There's the Homelander profile picture there. Hashtag go bolt for Justin Matthews here in the comment section. That's our own uh, Victoria Price there uh, standing by for a live report here as well. She is at Armature Works. So we'll be hearing from her, I believe, momentarily getting you back out here to Eagle 8 HD, showing the as Victoria looks up at the sky, probably looking at Eagle. And here you see our chopper feed showing the boat carrying the Stanley Cup. Here's a comment from Michael Johnson. Hashtag hey JB, hashtag hey Gabrielle. This is really cool. Can't say I'm not a little jealous. Hashtag distant thunder, hashtag thunderstruck. Well, Michael, yes, we wish you were here too, but glad we can bring you all of this coverage from all of these different camera angles. Really, really fun. Really exciting to be a part of this parade. And we're uh, very, very close here to a live report from our own uh, Victoria Price, who is standing by. NJ Devs fan, hashtag KDB, hashtag K Gabrielle. Congrats to hashtag Go Bolts, especially Blake Coleman from everyone here in New Jersey. Let's send things over to eight on your sides, Victoria Price. Hey, Keith, I hate to sound cliche, but it truly is electric out here. We've got the cup on that big gray boat that's coming right down the Hillsborough River. Most of the boats of the players have already come by, but everybody's still here. They are waiting for a glimpse of Lord Stanley's Cup. It's been really exciting. Not going to lie, there were a few champagne showers as some of the other players came down in their boats. At one point, Nikita Kucherov came down. Whole crowd started yelling, Cooch, Cooch. So it's just been so much fun down here. And again, everybody that's up here waiting, they've been waiting for hours. Thousands of fans lined up along the Hillsborough River as the Stanley Cup is finally making its way around the Big Bend and coming down to Armature Works. Look at all these folks. Are you guys ready to see the cup? I think they are ready. And like I said, it is coming down on one of these big gray boats. I'm going to move away so we don't fall off this little dock here. But that is the cup coming down. They've been lifting it up. This is the latter part of the parade making its way down the Hillsborough River. And this has been just such an experience. Everybody having so much fun, so much excitement. Um, earlier tonight, we saw Coach John Cooper coming down on his boat. That was maybe about 10 minutes ago. Obviously, he was having a blast. How could you not, considering everything they've been celebrating the last few days? And there we have it. You can see that big sort of blackish gray boat that's starting to come up around now, maybe about, I don't know, 100 yards from where we are in the stock. They're lifting the cup. That is Lord Stanley's Cup, and it is happy to be here in Tampa Bay. The fans here are happy to finally see it with their own eyes. This is such an exciting moment, and I think, Jen and Keith, you guys mentioned it. You, uh, you mentioned it earlier. If anyone knows how to throw a boat parade, it is Tampa. So while things may be a little funky this year with the pandemic, this has been certainly a celebration to see. So I'm going to give you one last look as they're bringing the Stanley Cup around on that gray boat here at Armature Works. Hopefully we'll try to get them to maybe lift it one more time. The crowd's getting excited. They're ready to see it. Uh, one last glimpse here. And uh, for now, I'll send it back to you. There we go. One last. There's the cup, ladies and gentlemen. That is the Stanley Cup arriving here at Armature Works. And Keith and Jen, I'll toss it back to you now. JB Buno here with you back on WFLA Now. Sarah Mastro, so proud of this team. Epic season. Hashtag Hey Gabrielle. Hashtag Hey Paul. Hashtag Hey JB. And hashtag Go Bolts. Sarah, thanks so much for joining us here on WFLA Now. Uh, there is the Stanley Cup arriving at Armature Works in the hands of Victor Hedman, the Con Smythe Trophy winner. Uh, Thomasina Supon. Hashtag Hey JB. Hashtag Hey Gabrielle. Where's Cooch? He's, the, he's there. He's on a different boat. Obviously, <laughs> look at Stamkos just drinking some beer. Um, the players are split up on different boats. I know it's really tough to see, especially when we're at a distance um, from Eagle 8 HD, but the numbers are on the sides of the boats. So look for that number 86. Joey Deeb, hashtag go bolt. Stanley Cup on a boat, drinking beer out of it. We love Florida and our lightning. 
Steven Stamkos, Victor Hedman. The, so the players are spread out here across multiple boats. So we're focusing on this one because this one's got the Stanley Cup. Right. Uh, Judith Rivera, <laughs> hashtag hugs. Go Bolts, watching from Philippines. Man, we're just racking up the country count here, buddy, on WFLA now. Hashtag whole, uh, Go Bolts for Judith Rivera. And uh, as we look here at Steven Stamkos and at Victor Hedman, the boat getting closer to really pretty much at Armature Works and getting closer to Rick's on the River where it's going to be uh, getting out of the water. And, uh, of course, okay, this... This is what we were talking about. Beautiful sunset shot here. Uh, everybody, take a screenshot on your phone. <laughs> Hit the screenshot button. Take it right now. Share. Tag Share us. it. It doesn't get any more beautiful than that. A <laughs> picturesque Tampa Bay sunset and the Tampa Bay Lightning hoisting the Stanley Cup for thousands here on the Hillsborough River. Enjoy Amen. it. Enjoy it. Take it all in. All right, I'll read this comment from Brendan Driscoll. Hashtag, hey, Gabrielle, watching from school in Durham. So wishing I was home tonight. I have never missed Tampa so much. Hashtag, go Bolts. Brendan, thank you so much for joining us. I am going to sign off because I am headed to the stadium where these players end the cup. They are going there as well. Um, it's a ticketed event, so those tickets, they've been, quote, unquote, sold out. They were free, but I will be bringing you photos, videos, et cetera, across our social media platforms, so stay with me. Follow me. I'm very excited. Can't wait to get there. Yeah, you want to know, uh, again, she's heading to Raymond James Stadium for the celebration at Raymond James Stadium. If you're, yes. if you're watching from Raymond James Stadium, comment at, or excuse me, hashtag at us, hashtag KJB, hashtag KGabrielle. want to hear from you because the chances of the of it starting on time probably slim to none here. The, the cup great. is still it's on the water there in the what? center of your screen. Because Raymond James Stadium probably already getting pretty pretty packed, as packed as it can with the pandemic and with social distancing guidelines in effect. But uh, let us know. Are you watching from Raymond James Stadium here, folks? The, uh, the cup is getting closer to your location. <laughs> Armature works here then Rick's on the river of course it'll get out of the water and then make its way in an open air trolley over to Raymond James Stadium the home of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers where it'll be part of the really the centerpiece of tonight's massive celebration who else will also be there look for Gabrielle Shirley she will be there again you have to have tickets from yes. Ticketmaster or press pass like Gabrielle has and uh, able to gain access of course to Raymond James Stadium for the one-of-a-kind event going on tonight so everyone say farewell to our own gabrielle <laughs> shirley we give her a big applause Aww, here on wfla guys. now and what's this shot here we have uh, coming in here uh, is that a is that a player that who just jumped like in coburn yeah coburn has has jumped in and is now <laughs> drinking a beer to cool it was off only a matter of time jb you take it over everyone stay with him for this awesome coverage and i will be coming at you with videos and photos from Raymond James. If you are at Raymond James Stadium tonight, look for our own Gabrielle Shirley and follow her <laughs> on social media. One more time, the social media following is uh, where? Uh, how do they find you, Gabrielle? Oh, gosh. Okay. Uh, Twitter, Instagram, uh, at WFLA Gabrielle, I believe. And Instagram is Gabrielle M. Shirley. Yeah, you guys, Give her, you guys will get, find me. For the, those of you in Philippines, in Sweden, <laughs> in the UK, in Australia, give her a follow and you'll get VIP access, some cool behind-the-scenes photos of what is going on tonight at Raymond James Stadium. Gabrielle Shirley, thanks so much for joining us here, everybody. Say farewell to Gabby, everybody. Now you're just stuck with me. It's not as fun, just me. But we appreciate you being here with us on WFLA Now, and we appreciate uh, one more time this player. Uh, who did you say it was? Was it Coburn? It is Coburn. Okay. Yeah, Coburn's having a, having a ball. Uh, having, having a blast here, everybody. Uh, getting you here to Eagle 8 HD. Uh, there is the boat carrying the Stanley Cup. Passing by Armature Works in downtown Tampa. Taryn, hashtag AJB. I just arrived in Tampa. I'm at Raymond James Stadium. Taryn, you got a really incredible seat. Cherish it. Cherish the moment. Take it all in. Enjoy yourself. It is going to be... Uh, one hell of a time tonight at Raymond James Stadium. Eagle 8 HD on the left. Coburn in his uh, Speedo there on the right. Uh, he just jumped in, and now he's uh, hoisting up members of his family. He's having the time of his life, as you would expect. He is a Stanley Cup champion. That is etched in permanent ink, everybody. Or rather, if you etched into silver for the Stanley Cup uh the jeweler, of course, in Canada, as we were talking about earlier, um, they're going to have their names inscribed on the Stanley Cup. And then look at this shot. We're going full screen to the Hillsborough River there on the right. Man, beautiful, beautiful night here in downtown Tampa. Will Ford Jr., hashtag Hey JB. There's Yanni Gord. 
Yeah, and there is... Uh, okay, Braden Point siding here, everybody. You wanted him. There he is. And Yanni Gord. Uh, Will Ford Jr., hashtag AJB, hashtag Go Bolts. Boston had a parade on duck boats in the past. Okay, interesting. Alex and Stammer had Stanley on the jet ski. Okay, so... Uh, but you know what? You can't really jump into the water there in Boston, can you? Not without fear of hypothermia. Uh, the waters here are a little bit warmer in the Tampa Bay area, comfortably warm. If you've ever jumped in the waters of Tampa Bay this time of year, especially after uh, uh, you know many, many months of 90-plus degree weather, it's plenty warm uh, and probably feels really good at Braden Point. And Yachty Gord going crazy. Let's, or let's see if we can listen in here, everybody, if we can listen in to Yanni Gord. J.B. Buno back with you here, everybody, on WFLA Now. I had to check a couple of things ahead of our stream uh, concluding here again once we, uh, once we, the Stanley Cup leaves the water, the things transition to the event at Raymond James Stadium tonight. Let's get back to some of your comments here, everybody, on WFLA Now. Like from Leanne here, hashtag Go Bolts. How symbolic a boat parade representing the, ta uh, the Bolts sinking Dallas and capturing Lord Stanley's cup. Pyre Booty! 
is the question here from Leanne. As we bring the virtual confetti down, if you use hashtag GoBolts or hashtag KJB, we'll be looking for your comments here. Jen LaRue, congrats, Bolts from Chicago. Don't <laughs> drop the cup in the river. We want it back. Hashtag go bolts. We got a Blackhawks fan here, folks. Jen, thanks so much for joining us and commenting along here with us. As we have a swimmer here, and may, that very well might be a <laughs> a lightning player. Mackenzie uh, Blakely uh, watching from Spring Hill. Watching them take the cup was the best night of September. Hashtag go bolts for Mackenzie. Wow, what a beautiful shot that we have here from the Hillsboro River. Really special here, folks. Corey Milliken, hashtag ADB. What's the atmosphere around Tampa this week with the Bolts taking home Stanley? Born and raised in Tampa, live in New York now, hashtag go Bolts. Uh, Corey, you and I did a, uh, a little bit of a role reversal. I was in New York and ended up in Tampa. You were in Tampa and ended up in New York. Uh, I can tell you that it's... Uh, it's a little bit sweeter with how 2020 has gone that these fans here have something to celebrate. And especially with, uh, with the political climate right now in our country, uh, of course, we streamed many, many hours of, of presidential debate coverage last night here on WFLA Now. And uh, we know that during election season, things can get divisive, but not when you're talking about a celebration like this. I can guarantee you here that in this crowd, it doesn't matter if you are a... Uh, a supporter of President Trump or if you would rather see Joe Biden in office, your political allegiance doesn't matter when the first and foremost thing at the front of your mind is the fact that you are cheering on the lightning. You're cheering on your franchise, your team, the bolts here in Tampa Bay. So it, that is that all goes away for for a few days. Uh, the, the, the forefront of people's minds here in Tampa Bay, here in Florida, isn't necessarily... Uh, politics right now it's the Tampa Bay Lightning and it's bringing us all together and it's a very very special thing here for the city of Tampa uh every, and really the entire Tampa Bay area look at the sunshot that we have here from Eagle 8 HD Johnny Walker hashtag or excuse me just go bolts can't wait to see the excitement over at Ray J yeah we can take you inside Ray J just for a, a quick moment here everybody a very very brief uh, a br oh actually wait is that who do we have here? We have another shot here to bring you. Hold on here, folks. I'm going to try to take you to another picture that we have here. Oh, we have lost it. Okay, we're starting to lose uh, uh, several of our feeds here. Uh, we do have a live picture to show you here very, very briefly from inside Raymond James Stadium. This is a live picture from inside the stadium here, and this camera has been bouncing around, showing us some different shots. Hopefully we'll see some shots here in a moment. Uh, Brianna Brockington, Ashley Go Bolts. The parade has been amazing, and to top it all off, the Rays advance to the ALDS. Let's go. Really excited for the Tampa Bay Rays, the number one seed in the American League. Uh, Rick Carbone, hashtag AJB, get ready for Rays Parade soon. <laughs> Great job, Lightning. Yeah, there is Raymond James Stadium. Congratulations to the 2020 champions on the banner there at Raymond James. An odd sight, right? The home of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers throwing up Tampa Bay Lightning graphics. Very cool. So this is a, a very quick inside shot of the stadium. And this wraps it up here for our coverage on WFLA Now. So glad to have you here with us here, everybody. Uh, again, one more shot in, in, inside the stadium. Uh, that's a live picture from inside Raymond James Stadium. Uh, so glad to have you here with us here, everybody. Angela, hashtag go bolts. Lightning strikes more than once. I want to thank Paul Lamas and Gabrielle Shirley, our entire team in the field that's providing us, been providing us with these with these pictures here. So glad to uh, to have you with us. Tamara Adams, Morrison, hashtag go bolts. Everyone using the hashtag hey JB, hashtag hey Gabrielle, hashtag go bolts. We really appreciate you joining us here. Uh, Seven thirty is we believe the scheduled start time. No way it's going to start at seven thirty, but sometime after seven thirty, we have of course the uh, the the celebration, the Stanley Cup celebration inside Raymond James Stadium, the home of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. You can throw that comment up here one more time. Uh, Jerry uh, Swarat, exciting times we are in today with hashtag Go Bolts, bringing back the Stanley Cup to get us its well-deserved tan. And then all the lightning bolts emojis there. And we'll end out on this. JJ Jedi, hashtag ABB, thank you for streaming. Tampa girl watching from Dallas. I would have been at every game if it weren't for COVID-19. 
Stoker. Stoked to have Stanley back in the Bay where he belongs. Hashtag go Bolts. Everybody, it's been a blast to be here with you. For all of you commenting along here with us, thanks so much. What a boat parade. Huge round of applause for the city of Tampa, the Tampa Bay Lightning, the entire Tampa Bay area, all the fans that came out, uh, and now all the fans that are filing into Raymond James Stadium. This is cool. This is history. This is Bolts hockey. And we were, we were just so honored to be able to be part of this. Very, very close to the Tampa Bay Lightning organization here at WFLA. They are a tremendous organization from the top to the bottom. We really appreciate you joining us here. Tampa Bay, we did it. The Lightning, 2020 Stanley Cup champions. Of course, the coverage continues here, or the festivities rather continue from Raymond James Stadium, the home of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, where we're going to see the Tampa Bay Lightning, the entire franchise hoisting the Stanley Cup tonight here at Ray J in Tampa. For Gabrielle Shirley, Paul Amison, I'm J.B. Buno for our entire WFLA team. Thanks for joining us here on WFLA Now. Go Bolts, everybody. We appreciate you being with us. Take care, and we'll see you soon.